What is up, YouTube? Champions of the Realms, week four, pool play. This week was super interesting. We had a, a player on a Heidi account running around, just causing a lot of chaos in the bracket. I mean, you're going to see who it was because me and Kaboosh just could not stop talking about the player. We were just kind of torn between who it was, trying to figure out who the hell this player was. Week four, top eight is going down this Friday on Caboose's Twitch channel. If you guys want to stay up to date with the full top eight roster, make sure you follow myself or Caboose on the Twitter page. We're going to be uploading the top eight, the full top eight bracket over there. And again, thank you so much, everybody, for the love and support. It's been unreal running this series for the community and just getting the feedback. Thank you so much. As always, if you've been enjoying this content, do me a huge favor. Hit that thumbs up button. Hit that subscribe button and enjoy this week four pool play action. Welcome everybody to Champions of the Realms 2 Week 4. We're here. It's live. I hope you guys are excited. We're going to be bringing you guys another week of some crazy action. This tournament sponsored by CGL. Exclamation point CGL in the chat. Console Gaming League providing $1,000 to that prize pool. Destroyer, how you doing? I'm doing great, Caboose. Week 4 going down today, man. And the bracket... It's unique. We got a lot of new players, a lot of new faces showing up to the tournament. And mm -hmm. I feel like, uh, you know, a lot of people are just coming out of their shell. They said, hey, I want to get involved and I want to see if I can get a shot at this top eight. So it's going to be a very interesting week. I got to say yeah. so myself. And if you guys want to check out the bracket, exclamation point bracket in the chat. And we're getting straight into things. You know, we want to bring you guys this action ASAP. That's right. First match for the night is going to be Baylina, Kunoichi's very own Baylina, going yep. up against Focus Fox. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. This should be hype. I am really excited for week four to begin. I mean, last week was uh, last week was a doozy, Destroyer. We, yeah, last week we was had a douchebag. Insane. Yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> last week, we had some insane matches, especially during the top eight. And as with what we always mention each and every week, when those, when the number of qualifiers starts to dwindle down, when there's just less and less spots to make it into that finale, the competition just gets more intense. So as we head now, just about at the halfway point for Champions of the Realms 2, let's see how crazy things are going to get. First match underway between Focus Fox and Baylina. Ooh. Here we go. This should be a juicy one, man, because we've seen Baylina make an appearance before in the Champions of the Realm. Yeah. And she's no fucking joke. No, you're absolutely Sorry. right. Hey, absolutely right. going with a katana, katana, katana pick rather than the uh, the usual Sonya Blade. Let's see how this works yeah, out here. Be interesting. We got Focus Fox with the Jax. I didn't quite see what uh, what variation and what tools they're bringing to the set here, but I'm sure it's it's good either way. Uh, just wondering if we got any mods in chat to set up some predictions. That would be dope. Please hook it up if you can, because I know everybody really likes the predictions. But all right. As we're into this match right now, a bit of a back and forth. Right now, Focus Fox having the life lead, trying to push Baylina towards the corner. Ooh. Over oh my god! Ninja Killer with a huge raid. Holy Big shout out, Ninja Killer. Shit. Oh, Thank no. you so much. Baylina trying to go for the fatal blow, but it's gonna whiff. This is getting crazy. Their string pushes are far enough. Oh, that's is this it. gonna kill? No, the breakaway. No. 
Oh, she didn't oh! have the fatal blow! Focus Fox with the wake up fatal blow, pulling the trigger, no remorse, taking round number one. Unbelievable. That was a little scramble at the end there. And again, huge shout out to Ninja Killer with the crazy host. Holy shit. Oh, boots, I think, I think I just shit my pants. <laughs> I, I wasn't aware there. I thought that Baylina had gotten the fatal blow back, but unfortunately, she was out of that fatal blow, still wasn't able to end that round. And a nice little just wake up fatal blow from Focus Fox. Although, Baylina kind of just brushing that last round off and doing a really good job in this second round. Maintaining control has a very healthy life lead. Oh, yeah, this is huge. Dominating plays from Baylina here. Literally taking away this life bar with. Ease. I don't want to say it with ease. And <laughs> look at this name, Booty Warrior, bro. The oh, fuck is going on here? <laughs> if we don't see that fucking ass crushing blow happen anywhere between this set, <laughs> I'm gonna be disappointed. Big crushing blow there from Baylina. She continues this full screen onslaught, gets a nice hit in there. This is gonna be a huge combo over 28%. And so far, Baylina working on a flawless round. Oh my okay, god. Focus Fox is gonna get some hits in. The wake up version. Overhead. Combos. Caboose, the mix up from Katana right now are looking so brutal. They're coming yeah. so quick out of nowhere and focus fox i think he needs to get a little more focused because these 50 50s are hurting him that's right that was a really good first game after a tough first round loss off that wake up fatal blow Baylina immediately answers back with a quick two rounds to win the game yeah definitely a dominant performance coming out of kunoichi's Baylina here let's see if focus fox is going to be able to tighten things up a bit you know, the Jax was looking clean in the beginning. He stole the first round with that fatal blow. Jax. Maybe it was luck. Maybe it was a master plan all along. But we're going to see right now. You know, this is a first to three setting. These players do have some type of room here to kind of adjust to the play styles. For sure. So, yeah, let's see if Focus Fox is going to be able to do this. Oh, I see the, the moves now. Left to play. Oh, yeah, dude. Oh, yeah, that's right. I mean, considering this set and the rest of the pool plays we have for tonight, a lot of Mortal Kombat. Oh, good bluff from Baylina. That neutral jump is doing wonders right now for Baylina. She's definitely baiting out those wake ups and button presses in general from Focus Fox. Blocks the overhead, gets a good counter. There's another wake up and a throw will connect. Very good stuff. Tries to catch him with the low. Dude, I just realized, man, Baylina is playing Mortal Kombat X. She's got 50-50 specials, and she is... Oh, just whipping oh. the fatal blow. Hold on, though. Focus Fox can open her up. Whoa! Wow. Really? Just raw? Throw it out like that? Okay, the fans will do it. That was some savagery right there, Caboose. Just a little bit. Oh. Man, Focus Fox is getting tagged by all these fan tosses here. He's having a hard time getting in on Baylina. Wow, Baylina's playing really well right now. Has that corner Holy control. Shit. Huge combo conversion into the crushing Holy blow. Blocks the wake up. She's playing out of her mind right now. Seriously. Trying to get up two to zero here. Focus Fox, though, he's got some serious pressure going on. Just as I say that, Baylina fighting her way out of the corner. Oh boy. Fatal wow. blow is not really working out for Focus Fox. And Baylina now goes up 2 0 in the set. Bro, I feel like he got Focus Fox. He's got his coach in the corner right now. He's like, Focus! Focus, you fucking Fox! Focus! <laughs> and he's there sweating his ass off. He's like, I can't. I can't focus. <laughs> this is getting no, wild you, you, you gotta give it up as well to Baylina She's just making all the right decisions here Landing her combos There is not a missed opportunity in sight Yeah, very good plays right now Let's yeah. see if Baylina yeah. is gonna be closing this out Or Focus Fox is yes. gonna channel his inner Ultra Instinct And make this comeback you know, he's smoking on that OG Kush right now that he needs to wake the fuck up, Caboose. 
That's right. This is now or never for Focus Fox. If you're going to make the reverse Rio, it's got to start at this moment. Here we go. Game three underway. Baylina up 2-0 right now. Doing really well. Ooh. Catching the air to air. Very good stuff from Focus Fox. But immediately, Baylina answering back with an anti-air down one. Oh, that's a punish. No! Dude. I don't think Focus Fox is really focusing right now. I think he needs to drink some uh, G Fuel. Code Caboose. If he I wants to so. wake up. Hey, you guys seen that Mortal Kombat G Fuel's up for pre-order right now. If you want to get yourself the uh, the Sub-Zero or the Scorpion sub, it's available. Hit that code Caboose, exclamation point, G Fuel in the chat. As I'm saying all that, though, Melina continuing the onslaught. Oh, my God. Gotta watch out for that fatal blow. Yeah, and there it is. A flawless block, though, from Baylina. She's ready for it once again. That worked one time and one time only. She said, fool me once. She said, you don't impress me. <laughs> okay, very good opener right here. Focus Fox finally getting some damage on the table, but drops it. What the hell? I don't think I can see another drop like that. <laughs> I'm going to go to the Kano, the bar. I'm going to say, Kano, let me get... Uh, let me get the ice JJ fish cold on the rocks. <laughs> and, uh, I'm gonna go to Kano and I'm gonna say, hey, can I get some of the Scorpion thing? G Fuel, exclamation point, G Fuel in chat, focus who's a checkout. <laughs> and he's gonna say, no, I spit attacker. No, I think he's gonna fucking throw a knife at your head at that point. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, the fatal blow is ready. I you know think what that means, Destroyer. I don't know, man. I don't want to jinx anything, but yup, Baylina shutting it down. Gonna take the match. 3-0 over Focus Fox. Dominant performance. Making the Kunoichis proud. That was sick, Caboose. That was fucking sick. Yeah, dominant indeed. She played out of her mind really well. And again, she got caught by that Fatal Blow one time in the first match. And since then, blocked it or shut it down every single time. Oh, yeah, dude, that fatal blow really unleashed a demon in Baylina. But very GG is going to be advancing in the winner's side. Let's see, let's see if she can keep up that uh, that composure there. Very good stuff. Yeah, I think we got a, indeed. I think we got another really good matchup coming up next. Let me take mm -hmm. a look. Also, huge shout outs to Mary Luna running the brackets right now. We got uh, again, you know, each week we've been consistent with 100 plus contenders every week which is mind-blowing to me you know it just that always goes to show that you guys have interest in the tournament you guys want to be involved in this action and it's just motivation to keep me and caboose you know keeping this series running for the community so thank you so much yeah. competitors for signing up because this week looks like a juicy one yeah no seriously as destroyer said thank you everybody very much for signing up for tuning in already we're almost at a thousand viewers in part because of a huge raid from ninja killer thank you very much once again for that to anybody who's resubbed or anything like that in the chat i apologize if i missed it but i appreciate your guys continued support on the channel and for champions of the realms in general you guys are incredible and then yeah as you said as well big shout out to mary luna running the bracket behind the scenes the backbone of the tournament what's our next master sure what do we got do <laughs> you all right, all right. Let me see if I can if I can try and set up the predictions here. I gotta figure this out. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, Mods are, uh, Mary, they're, they're Mary, Mary could help you out. Mary, could you help out Caboose with the predictions? Teach him the ways, or else he's gonna fall to the dark side, and you're gonna see him in a pit of lava. He's gonna say, ah, "I was a chosen one." <laughs> Everybody's gonna be crying for Caboose. He's gonna be no legs. He's gonna be on fire. <laughs> wants to see that oh you guys want to see that all right let's make it happen Round who's the guy who does my Fight. bandana shout out to welly all right here we go game one underway i see a you don't impress me get to the chopper get to the chopper you know what's crazy too? Killtron not going with the Jax. Instead, he's opting to go for this turkey in the face ass character. Kotokan. 
Nah, I'm sorry. I what? He looked like a fucking turkey with that headpiece. What are you Just talking a about? Just a little bit. A goddamn peacock. A very good pressure right now. He's got striker locked down in the corner. Big boss Cordo putting that pressure to work. Oh, he gets the throw. The throw reset. This is huge. Good blocks and the kitty cat pounce gonna take round number one for Killtron. What is going on here? He's got the variation name called Dayman. Ah! <laughs> what is that? You know what oh, that is? Big down to crush. You know what that variation name means from Killtron? Yeah, it's uh Yeah. 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 Alright guys, I think I got the prediction. I think I got the prediction. Oh, let me try this out. Try it out, try it out. Sorry about that guys. Alright, here we go. Another big crushing blow from Killtron. Gonna land the command grab. Wrap this game up. Golden press me, me. Yo, what's crazy too is fucking Striker was going bananas in that corner. He was hitting him with all the mix he had, and Killtron literally just said, "You don't impress me." <laughs> oh I like shit! Killtron, Kil Killtron won the match. People are still voting for Striker. Oh, oh, wait, no. Now it's a bit of a back and forth. Hold on, you you might have you might have messed up the predictions then. <laughs> they shouldn't be able to vote anymore. <laughs> no, I put it in a little late. I put it in a little late. It's okay. It's only one game in. It's only one game you in. You know what? I'm gonna unfollow you. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, I'm kidding. Speaking <laughs> <laughs> of unfollowing, make sure you guys follow the channel. Follow this channel right now. Hit the follow button. If not, I will personally ban you. Oh my god. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm whoa, kidding. Whoa. I'm kidding. I won't do that. I won't do that. Calm it down. Calm I won't do that. I won't do that. Relax. Alright, but here we go into game two. Kiltron got a game on the board. Let's see if Striker is going to be able to make something happen with the Terminator. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Yo, what, is he drowning? <laughs> is, it the low? is the Terminator drowning or something? What's happening? Uh, you tell me. Oh, good cancel. Trying to do the running man deluxe on his face. He's going to keep him in the corner. What's it going to be? Going for the stagger pressure. Oh, wow! Oh, Kiltron. that was some interesting stuff. Definitely very interesting, but Kiltron just grabbed him. He said, fuck out of here, bitch. He didn't say all that, but, you know, that's what he wanted to say. Right, yeah. Oh! The wake up trying to go for the Albi backbreaker. It gets neutral duck and a big combo there from Striker. He bit oh, Arnold's neck off. Oh, a command grab as well there from Kiltron once again. Amplification. Maintains the corner control. Good wake up. Oh, wait, oh my god, he no has 4 two. He could have gone the fatal blow. He didn't commit. Oh, but he gets no the way, back bro. three, no and way. that should be the game or the round. Sorry. That did not that just happen. Yeah. Striker. I feel like that was so random the way that just played out. But gonna play in Striker's favor. Gonna burn the image. He said, you want to see the picture? <laughs> you can't see it because it's on fire. <laughs> Get over here. Get over here. Whoa, that was some wow. crazy stuff there from Striker. Still has this corner. Tried to go for the low. Obviously a bit of a delayed wake up there from Kiltron. Running in. Oh the air ground anti-air. A lot of stuff happening in a little amount of time. I don't even Command know how to grab. comprehend this. Is that crush? It's oh, it crush. is. How much damage are we looking at here? Kiltron has no breakaway. He has to hold all of it. Oh my Yo! god, the reads! That was gnarly. Okay, but second. Kiltron's going to wake up Fatal Blow. Kiltron definitely still in this. He just woke up. He said, get off of me. This that is was actually insanity. I love the setup there. Striker, and he tried to pull out the shotgun. Come on, but going to get caught by the pizza oh pie. God. He's going to put the down three anti here. Is he dead? Not oh, yet. Not gonna be. Yo, this is Backing way too up, close. Yo, Tron needs to get one hit. Oh. And this could oh, do it. Block Wait him. a second. Oh, no, oh, no, 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 no. Oh. And he got the boot. Das boot to the face. We're tied up.
Holy fuck, what is this set? Is this the sleeper set of the night that we all been waiting for, Caboose? Match you number two, the sleeper set of the night. You don't impress me. You don't. You don't impress me. You don't. You don't. You Go, get to the chopper. Go. Bro, Arnold needs to relax. Seriously, he's got one game on the board. The, the match ain't even over yet. And he's over here popping the fuck off with his goddamn clone babies. <laughs> uh, goo goo ga ga, I'm a clone baby. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. The Terminator. Let's see here if Kiltron is gonna be able to, you know, make this, this reverse happen. Striker taking game number one, and I feel like that was kind of strange towards Kiltron, bro. He just needed one more read at the last second there. You, you know, when he caught him with that with that combo, instead of going for the reset, I wonder how things would have played off if he went for the uh, for the max damage, you know? Yeah. Oh, oh hovering over Jax early on in the set. Character switch, yeah. This That's might be what he needs. I but mean, I don't know. Do you think so? There was there was a decent enough back and forth, I feel. It in that was. Last game. It definitely was. But personally, I know I know Kiltron because of his Jax. You know, so seeing him bring out the jacks, it makes me feel like he he's uh, going back home here, going back to his uh, comfortable his comfortable spot. Let's see what he does though. He's gonna catch him with the the pounder. Step on the nuts. Oh Another. my other God! This time he didn't step on the nuts. Thank God. Good command grab. Keeping the corner position. Striker right now. Trying to hit him with a down one command grab, but Kiltron was ready for it. Are we going to see Crush? Power bomb. No, no, no. Yo, oh, this is a grab. grappler's match off here, Caboose. Seriously. String on the back three. Oh, he broke away. Oh, he oh. go Fatal. Shades of the last set that we were watching. A little wake up Fatal blow action from Kiltron. Got to secure this round now, though. Otherwise, that's a wasted... Fatal blow. Let's see what Striker does here. Oh! Projectiles, and he's gonna spend both the meter to close the round with the sawed-off shotgun. That was so clutch from Striker, shutting down the ground pound from Jax. That could have went any other way. Good neutral jump from Kiltron. He's gonna get a nice punish here. What's the damage looking like? He's gonna throw him against the wall? No, knocking his oh, face no, off. Then. Man, that anti are working out really well there for Striker. Been very oh, consistent no. with that. Another command grab lands with a little empty short hop. Oh, he catches him. Caught. Oh, this could be Crush. It will be, I believe so. Yes, indeed. Gonna bend up the endoskeleton a little bit. And the power bomb amplified, amplified again. Beautiful stuff from Kiltron. Not getting the crushing blow. He knows he's saving it for the special moment. He's got to try to catch him with that command grab mix up here, though. Because, you know, that is a crucial resource for Jax, I feel. That's like 50% for a fucking command grab. Oh, no. Oh, my God. What is going on right now? Striker just having his way with Kiltron. Beautiful pressure. That's definitely oh, shuts down the down one! For Kiltron, because he is out of that fatal blow, so he's really just got to make it happen with as many hits as possible. Okay. Oh, this is looking yep. incredible Stop. right now! Holy shit! Oh, God. He oh, he was overhead. looking for the forward, too! He blocks the overheads! Oh, my God. I am literally losing my fucking mind right now. Kiltron is ascending right before our eyes, Caboose. Great first match, or sorry, great third match there to go up 2-1 in this set. Kiltron definitely making use of that character switch. Bro, I cannot believe what is happening. Fucking Striker is going for the most bizarre mix-ups we've ever seen, and Kiltron is blocking right and catching the punishes to clutch out the matches for him. This is madness. Madness, you say? This is Sparta! Yes. 
Feels like we're in 2009 all over again. All right, Joe Butler, relax. But hey, I will say, like, regardless, you know, Kiltron did take that game, but again, a very close match. That was one forward two into Fatal Blow away from being the game for uh, for Striker there. Mm -hmm. So now as we head into game four, I can certainly see us heading into a game five. Let's see what happens here, man. You know, Kiltron, he has the momentum. He has the match in the bag if he plays things right. He just needs to close this out here and now. Going to a game five against a character like fucking Terminator is a nightmare, Caboose. Dealing with these 50-50s, dealing with this massive damage he can imply out of nowhere. It's just something you don't want to deal with. Oh, no. Oh, he missed the running man, unfortunately, because a hit landed there. Gonna get hit into restand. Is he gonna spend it? Power bomb. No. Just spending one bar to keep the corner, I believe. Yo, that whip punish the boost. This could be brutal. Oh, the dropped combo. Anti air. My goodness. Striker has been incredible with that. He gets to get him, bro. Setting up for that crushing blow. Oh! Or into Das Boot. Das Boot. Oh my god, he literally just said, fuck you. Are you serious? I, he did. <laughs> I don't believe it. He did, I'm telling you. Oh, that's yeah, that's gonna be an easy punish. Just like the charging health spawn for uh for spawn. That's one of those moves where you could you could be sitting there until 2077 and you could still punish Terminator if that if that whips. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you. Crushing blow. Fuck you. I'm just so heated up. I got another anti air. Fuck you. With the shotgun. It's not going to game five. Die. Die. Fuck you. Die. <laughs> Bro, sometimes the Arnolds in the background, they just get out of control. A little too much. They yeah. just get out of control. Seriously, me and Caboose are just trying to commentate this match. And the way the Arnolds get sometimes is just, we got to up the security. Yeah, it's too much, honestly. We got to up the security. Fuck you. Fuck you. Oh, my God. He's, he's push, just get him out. Just get Fuck him out. You. I, already told, I already told the Arnold on my end to get the hell out of it. Oh my god, they, they're out of control, guys. They're out of control. Okay! Alright! Alright, Terminator! Alright! Yeah, I don't know what's happening anymore, Caboose. If you if you look outside your window, bro, it's just a, a thousand Arnolds. It's a sea of Arnolds here. Oh, sh oh shit. Is it Judgment Day? <laughs> yeah. It's Judgment Day. <laughs> it is Judgment Day. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, no, but this match is Judgment Day. Fucking 2-2 two, two right now. Uh, it's Yo, too, it's too early to be getting this type of shit, man. What the fuck? Yeah, I know. This level of hype this early is a little too much for my heart. But okay, as we now go into game five, just as I was thinking. Two games of peace. I'm really liking Striker's Terminator. But all the same, Kiltron's Jax is super solid. The character switch definitely Oh my god, a what a whip punish. One. Big whip punish indeed. Striker going to get this corner control off of it too. Spending the meter on the Albi Backbreaker, always setting up for Ooh. that crushing blow. Whiffs that Albi Backbreaker that time. Oh my god, these two are really fighting to the death here. Is he going to spend it? No, he just gets the corner position. We haven't seen that crushing blow yet from that command grab from Kiltron. Let's see what happens here. Oh, oh the setup with the crush. This is going to hurt a lot. Okay, but the breakaway oh, there. No. Forward two into the nut stomp. Uh, uh, he's still alive. The wake up three. Kiltron right now trying to go for the stagger in this boot. Going to put Striker on match point. Match point, you're right. Huge stuff for Striker, but Kiltron not going to give up without a fight. Heating up those arms. Down four. Striker just dashes up into the command grab. One, two, one, into the running man. Another command grab, my goodness. Little tick throws. The air grab, good conversion. Yo! Oh my God, the reed. The reed destroyer. What is Holy going on? Oh, Striker just Striker's playing out of his off. mind. Wait a okay. minute. Okay, the wake up two from Kiltron gonna catch him with a fatal blow conversion. 
He's gonna have arms max heated up. This could yep. be something huge. Yep. If he gets one crushing blow, we're gonna be even in the match, but no! Oh, but the he gets a grab! Oh shit, wait, wait! Ah! You don't impress me. I do trick shots for the community. <laughs> the trick shots. <laughs> Call of Duty Warzone. <laughs> 360 no scope. Yeah, 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 yeah. I did that. <laughs> GG. Wow, GG's indeed, man. Striker taking the set three to two. How do you how do you feel about that one, Caboose? Holy shit. Holy that was a uh, that was a pretty nuts set right there. Let me just make sure I complete Holy the uh, let me make sure I complete the prediction. Get everybody their channel points. Hey, a lot of people voted for Killtron, so some people are winning some channel points there off the vote for Striker. I'll make sure that uh I'll make sure guys on the next one. Yeah, that was some really good stuff though, man. Holy. Hell of a set. Can you hear me? Oh, sorry. I'm just uh, getting some stuff sorted out because there was a player we were supposed to get on stream. And, you know, I, I, I spoke to him, but he, he never checked in. So he ended up getting oh, did DQ'd. You deafen? Huh? Did you deafen? Yeah, I was muted. I <laughs> well, muted. Well, they couldn't hear me. <laughs> Wait, Whatever you, you did. <laughs> wait, you were muted too? I guess so. <laughs> wait, what? You shouldn't have been muted. That's weird. So everyone, everyone's saying, okay, okay, okay. I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I was muted. All right, it's all good. It's all good. Sorry about that, guys. Sorry about that, guys. All right. We're good. Uh, we're good. We're good. All right, hold on. We're going to get the next match for you guys in a second. Uh, okay, yeah. So it looks like the next match is going to be Blue Linkies versus Legion FGC. Okay, Blue Linkies. Woo. Another tough motherfucker that shows up to Blue these tournaments. Blinkies. Yeah, you know, this is the spawn, right? Auntie's the one that, that had the rain. Blue yeah, Linkies yeah, yeah. is the one that's dedicated to the spawn. That's right. Okay, okay. Let me get these invites uh, out. Blue Linkies and Legion, you said? Yeah, Blue Linkies and Legion FGC is going to be going at it. And again, I want to give a huge shout out to every single one of you tuning in, uh, checking out this action live. We truly appreciate it. Uh, also, the competitors showing up, you know, competing in the Champs of the Realms. Thank you so oh, much, guys. People sending in the bits. We got a hype Pipo. train going, I think. People pipe. We got a hype train. People Yo, pipe. Okay. Okay. People pipe. Okay. All right. I see you guys. Evolvo. 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 No. Yeah. Seriously. Thank you so much, everybody, for the love and support. We 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 truly appreciate it. Let's get this hype train to level nine thousand, if that's even a thing. Get this hype train to level 9,000, and I'll start throwing leche all over the place. All over the place. Leche bottles, not that type of leche. Relax, okay? <laughs> Relax. I'll take this shit to a level it don't need to be in. God damn it. All right, let me set up the, uh, let me set up the prediction. Let me set up the prediction. Listen, if this hype we train don't ma reach Rinkies. the max, if this hype train don't reach the max, I'm gonna fucking scream. Oh my God, we're still with the bits. I'm gonna the scream. The bits are insane. You want me to start the screaming? The are insane. Thank you guys so, so much for the hype train. No Bookworm no with the 10 gifted subs. Oh my God. You want me to start. Holy you, smokes. You, you want me to start screaming. CJ Scott with all the bits too. You guys are incredible. You guys are incredible. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm screaming. Here we go. I'm screaming. You're screaming? Scream it up. I'm screaming. Scream it up. Okay. Very good stuff. We got... The Joker going up against Spawn, a matchup you wouldn't have thought you'd be seeing in Mortal Kombat in a million years, right? Spawn versus Joker? Like, we oh know Spawn. We know Spawn fucking hates clowns, but. Come oh, on. Yeah. Come on. Very good down, down to. Big combo there for the Blue Linkies. Another 10 gifted from J Buddy. Holy no shit. Fucking way, yo. Holy shit. All right. <laughs> 300 bits from oh, Narco Tourism. Oh I'm my saying, god! All I'm saying is if I'm not gifted in the, I don't gotta sub in the chat. I, I, I'm out. <laughs> you have fun. <laughs> you guys are ridiculous. Thank you all very, very much for support. I'm trying to pay attention to the match, but you guys are going nuts. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, try to hit him with a standing three, four. Nothing's home. Wait a second. 
Blue Linkies gonna put what? No punish. Is that even punishable? Legion needs to be ready for those type of situations because that was a huge amount of damage just left out of the table there. Oh my god. Blue Linkies has Legion stuck in this corner right now. Gonna catch a nasty confirm. Wow! I down to crush. Okay, Legion trying to answer back now. Jay Bunny asked me to hydrate. I got you. Big corner combo. Landed the standing three. One more hit will do it for Blue Linkies. Don't want to count out Legion just yet, but the projectile from full screen will do it. And Blue Linkies will take the first game. Yo, that match was... It felt like it went way too fast. And then look at that fucking spawn saying, What the? What the? What the hell? What was that? That's how much Who he misses. That? That's how much he Who wants to that? see Wanda. Who did that? Somebody Yo. fucking get Wanda in the building immediately. You guys are ridiculous. 183% completed on a level five hype train. The wow. Just insanity in the chat. All the gifted subs. Everybody, if I'm missing anybody, seriously, thank you. 100 bits from, from Sith. Uh, 200 bits from Black Panther. Cruise Stay. control with a gifted sub. Wow, Somebody man. else gifted a sub earlier. You, you, you guys are nuts. You guys are nuts. You guys are nuts. You think Wanda is, is crying right now? Because of the hype train? Whoa, 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 whoa. Destroyer. What? What's this about? What? What's this about? What? Tell me. DJ Spanky Doodle says, You talking shit? Talking about power bombing me through a table? Who's that? Wait, where? DJ Spanky Doodle's in the chat? Oh, I knew it'd come to this, man. DJ, DJ Sp I knew it. Who gave, D who gave DJ Spanky Doodle the account? Who let him get it? <laughs> I knew it'd come to this moment. Who did that? I knew it'd come to this fucking moment. DJ, I swear, I swear to God, DJ. DJ Spanky Doodle. Who do you think you are? Fuck, man. Is that the original Spanky Doodle? <laughs> Whoa, anonymous! That's got, the five gifted. That's gotta be Spanky Doodle and anonymous gifting those subs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's gonna catch him with that. the low chain. Going to opt for some a little bit of projectile zoning. The empty jump in. But Legion said, "You want an empty jump in, bitch? I'll go in with the jump in three instead." How about that? Que lo que manito. Beautiful. Si quieres salami, toma puta salami. Ahí está, toma. Let's go. Let's go. Round two. And fight. As we usually see from Blue Linky spawn, the damage is ridiculous. Nice standing three into that back forward two. Legion though having a a bit more of a back and forth this game. Staying in it. Okay, amplifies the jack in the box, but gets caught from a projectile by Blue Linkies. Well, that standing three connected, no commitment though. Down four. Nice little anti-air with the Amplified Jack in the Box. Good stuff. All right. One, so two, one. Uh, after this, it looks like Mary fixed the shit for Crispy, so he'll be next. Very good. Okay. Very All good right. stuff. He's going to clip him with the cape. Throwing the Jack in the Box. That thing's like plus 7,000. Oh, Watch my God. Fatal blow. Watch out for that Fatal Blow Destroyer. You weren't kidding about that. He goes with the cancel instead. Oh no! Oh god! Oh god! One hit! One hit! Yo! Oh nice cancel! He's still alive! Fuck bro. He's still alive! Projectile! Oh my god! Ball is blocked. Twenty seconds left. Oh my god! He goes with the low. Tries to get the chip out. And oh! the projectile clipping his toes. Unbelievable! Blue Linky's going up to the O. Son of a bitch! And Spawn, you, you already know what Spawn wants to say. Spawn, Spawn sat on the throne and he went... <laughs> <laughs> what is he, fucking Jarek's apprentice? <laughs> Imagine he just keeps going like that. I could imagine. I don't see DJ Spanky Doodle saying nothing in the chat. Where you at? Hey, Where you at, huh, DJ? Hey, hey, hey. Don't, don't, don't talk to him like that. Huh? Stay. 
That's what I thought, DJ Stanky Doodle. Don't, don't talk to him like that, bro. Relax. Just stay, stick to the DJ table, huh? Bro, 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 relax, relax, relax. I'll, co- I'll do my commentary. You do the music. Bro, 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 relax, relax. Calm down. Calm oh, down. He's, 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 he's disrespecting Calm down. me in my chat. He's disrespecting me in my chat. Take a deep breath Who's in. Th- Who's this guy think he is? Take a deep breath in and relax. You speak night clouds. Relax and just don't worry, they're gonna use your fucking G Fuel code. <laughs> Ooh, the grab tech from Legion. Gonna catch him with a boxing glove. This is looking like a fucking HBO pay per view right here. Beautiful crushing blow out of nowhere from Blue Linkies. He's gonna throw the, the interact with his face. This is what he wants. This is what he wants. This is what he needs. Good counter. Gonna slam him straight to the get. Oh my god. This man is kind of steamrolling here. It's 1 0, right? It's not 2 0. Yeah, yeah, 1. More zoning coming out of Blue Linkies here. Legion really trying to fight back. Oh, the whip, but it's with the boxing gloves. That beautiful was soft. very flashy. Yeah, beautiful indeed. Very nice. Who was that? Who said that? Oh, again, I don't know. I'm not sure who that was. Is that Koro? Uh, maybe. Oh, Another shit. throw in the corner here. Blue Linkies trying to close this one out real quick. Looking for the low on that forward four. Wow, what a flawless block. Not able to finish the game, though. Don't want to give Joker that little bit of breathing room. No defensive meter for Blue Linkies. He's just going to have to eat this. Big combo. Wow, the no! double amplification. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No oh what a way. throw. No He's got to spend the crush. Way. He's got to spend the crush. Closes the round. What a match. Oh, wait, no. Apparently, okay, it is 2-0. It is 2-0. It is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. There was the the, the Wanda. The movie screen Wanda. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, yeah, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry. No, 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 Wanda, don't fucking hit me with the sun's light out. What do you mean? I, I already, I, I fixed the scores, Wanda. <laughs> oh, this combo incoming from Blue Linkies. Ends with the down two there. A throw connect. Legion got to find something now. Still has that fatal blow, though. Those fatal blow cancels were doing him wonders in coming back on that first round. Or in the last round, oh, I say. And the standing three anti-air. Blue Linkies will take the set. That is going to be a GG's in the chat. Blue Link, he's moving on with confidence here as he sits in the throne. And he says, I want Wanda. I want Wanda. Spawn, relax. Seriously, bro. You'll get your Wanda just after the tournament. Shit. No, he's got he's to kill Malboja first. <laughs> <laughs> Very good stuff we just witnessed there. Bless you. Bless Excuse you. Excuse me. <laughs> bless you. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. All right. Uh, okay, to everybody so, that voted there for uh, for Blue Linkies. Oh, congrats to everybody voted. So we're going to try to get this match uh, quick because this is actually kind of holding up things. Crispy Fungus versus Almighty Kitchen. Hopefully Almighty Kitchen is present. Well, let me get these invites out. I think... Uh, this PSN is Mystery NRS, not Crispy Fungus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And by the way, uh, Crispy Fungus, the next time you sign up for the damn tournament, make sure you put your actual PSN, not this fucking name that you created that's <laughs> not your PSN. Please Come on, and Christy. thank you. So I think uh, in like pro competition and shit, if you got your name wrong, I think you can get DQ'd for that. So... We're gonna have so to de- DQ him. Yeah, we should ban him from the tournament. Yeah, we're gonna ban him from the tournament. <laughs> no, JK, we're gonna let it slide. But let's get this next match going. <laughs> let me get these names: Crispy, uh, Crispy Cream, and he said his account is Crispy Fungus, but he can't use it. All right, that's it. We're gonna have to ban you from all future Mortal Kombat tournaments that are ever <laughs> that are ever to be produced. And we're gonna and we're gonna reach out all other organizers to get you banned from those two. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> He's fucked. He's fucked. <laughs> Yo, 
I just want to point it out there, man. I don't know if you guys are following the bracket, exclamation point bracket, but holy shit, Kunoichi's Baylina taking out Achilles. Moving on to Yo! fight. Yeah, this is getting wild. Moving on to fight Deadly Rebel. Wow, shout us to Baylina. Playing really well so far in the tournament. Hopefully we get to see more of the Katana in just a bit. But all right, it looks like we have both the players loaded up in the match. Um, to Samoan Mami. Make sure if, you, if you're having any issues with uh, with Smash or anything like that and checking in and all that, hit up one of the admins. Make sure you hit up Mary Luna. She's uh, she's helping out with the bracket and all that. So, so hit her up and hopefully you can get that stuff sorted. Unfortunately, on our end, what we're doing here, the way we got everything set up, we can't really do anything right now. So... Yeah, this should be a okay. good one. Almighty Kitchen cooking up a lot of uh, kakipeo in, in the in the cuisine. Okay. Let's see if uh, Crispy Fungus is going to eat it. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't remember Crispy Fungus Rock the last time we saw him. No, no, no. The last time we saw him, he was playing with co the, the collectioner, as you like to say it. Yeah, that's right. The collectioneer. Nice grab there. Rocking that, uh, rocking that Kano now. Rocking that Kano, man. I don't know. It looked like he got a clean shave for tonight. You know, just to impress the audience. Very good stuff. Gonna go with the Kano ball. And this isn't a bad pick. Let me tell you, going from a collector pick to a Kano pick caboose, that's like going from Jesus to Moses. I gotta I gotta do the I need to do the prediction. I'm sorry guys. Wow. I gotta do the prediction. Yo, I'm first sorry, of all, guys. why don't we do come on, can Ahmad help out Caboose and get these predictions rolling? You know, for Caboose, that would, that would for, be nice. for Caboose having to do this by himself, I'm actually ending the stream. I, we'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> for the champions, for the, for the, for the, for the champions of the realms, bloopers. Down one into the acid. Let's see if oh, kitchen trying to come into a combo, but stands in the fire. And right now, crispy fungus. Is throwing crispy fungus all over kitchen in the corner. This is kind of overkill. Be the round. I'm gonna tell you right now, man. Judging from the way crispy fungus was playing collector, like we all know, Kano actually became kind of fucking busted. You know when he dropped with the new with, custom with move. Custom? Yeah, yeah. You know, able to down one acid. You do all this crazy shit, all this dumb shit. He he has his plus string to jails on a couple members of the of the cast now. Like Kano is on another level, and. I, I'm not saying Collector is too far away from Kano, but it, it, it's it's a it's a pretty noticeable character switch going from Collector to Kano. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> for sure, for sure. Kano. Listen, yeah, well, my bad, guys, on the predictions. But listen, like I, I gotta commentate. I gotta, you know, I gotta head to Smash GG sometimes. I gotta, I gotta do the predictions. I gotta, I gotta get the spins. I gotta Cabalin. I gotta. Can anyone stop me? Can anyone stop me? You know, like, what do you want me to do? You know what? That's it. End the stream. End the stream. End it. Wrap it up. I'm done. I'm leaving. Fight. Okay, both of them whiffing buttons right at the start there. He's going to go with the, with the forward two stagger. No conversion because their trade kind of just fucked both the players over. Oh, here, that's, nice that, yep, that's the string I was talking about earlier. Just spit in people's faces like a fucking pandemic is not even a thing. <laughs> an animal. Uh, uh, Kano would definitely be the type of guy. Right? <laughs> oh, you just tossed the fire oh, in the ground. Uh, With the launcher, what is this? Here. Bro, that setup was too crazy. Caboose, this is too much. He's gonna throw Patrick Star. Patrick Star has been tossed. Oh man, and Kitchen tried to go for a Nomad Dash, but ran into a knife, and now Kano's gonna catch a Noise Spin Attacker. No, Noise, Noise Spin Attacker. Tries to tag him with the acid. He's gonna open him up. This is looking like all mystery right now. Oh my god, the Kano Ball right to his face. 
Nice. No, no, no real punish that comes from it. Another jump and connect. Okay, that's gonna be a big crush. Not able to get anything off the breakaway there from Crispy Fungus. And now Kitchen starting to gain a little bit of momentum. Very good stuff. The down one. Gonna try to get the pressure going still. That's that plush string, man, that everybody despises from Kano. He's gonna put the flames on the ground, instantly going for a Kano ball. Almighty oh, Kitchen is in trouble! Wow. Wow. A big first two games there from Crispy Fungus. Absolutely a statement and a half. And now he's gonna go, Jump the job, mate. Jump the job. Nice bit attacker. He said, oh, you go to spins? Because if you go to spins, I'm going to spit right in your face, you stupid bitch. Whoa, 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 whoa. Kano, hey, Kano, hey, Kano, 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 Kano. Hey. This is a PG-13 stream. Kano? Whoa. Oh, don't give a fuck, PG. Fuck you. Whoa, whoa. Hey. Fuck you. Whoa, 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 whoa. End the stream. Hey. Nice, Vida. Nice. I don't know, man. Today is like the atmosphere is very violent. Very violent. Special force. A little bit, yeah. There's some hostility. Yeah, usually the characters, you know, on the set in the studio, they're all calm and chill. But today, a lot of people are riled up. I don't know what's in the in the stars or what's in the sky or what's what's in the air. Maybe Baracho might have farted. Huh? I said maybe Baracho might have. Yeah. Oh my god. You have a oh, smoke to start off this next game. You have a smell of a right fart? I hope I never do. I can arrange a meeting with Baraitro. <laughs> <laughs> These throws are doing a lot of damage right now for Crispy Fungus. My goodness, he is uh he is unstoppable. Can anyone stop him? Can anyone stop him? Oh he tried to down two punish, but he wasn't able to get it. You want me to arrange the meeting? Yeah, make it happen. Oh, just a down two punish there off the block. Oh. Kano ball. I'm not exactly sure what's happening here with Almighty Kitchen, but it looks like Crispy Fungus now on match point. Needs one more round to take this set. Oh my god, the back two gonna send them flying across the screen. Wait a second. He goes with the plus frames. Almighty Kitchen gonna duck right under, catching him with a crushing blow. Could this be the moment of truth? Did Almighty Kitchen finally step away from the kitchen and focus on the fucking set? I have no idea what just happened there. Nice overhead connect. He's all safe there. Oh, the 1-1-1 one, one, one into oh Nomad Dash. Oh my god. Okay, good stuff. A nice little combo there. Kitchen trying to make that happen. Gets caught by the down two crush though. No, no combo that follows. He was looking yeah. for the armor breaker. He, he tried was, to go yeah. for the restand armor breaker yeah. there, but he's not gonna get it. Tossing acid right in his face. Wait a fatal blow! Fuck it, just do it! Bro! What is he doing? Bro! Oh my god! Almighty oh, Kitchen, a bro! Down 2-0, you Almighty gotta do it now kitchen, or never! Bro. He's on fire, tries to jump in! He just goes for a raw fatal blow! I have no idea what happened there. So unfortunate. Kitchen had the opportunity to tie up the round, but on but it is what it is. Crispy Fungus gonna be moving on, taking the set 3-0. Kotalkan, what do you think about that? You think he should have spent the fatal blow? Kotalus? Kotal, you think he should have spent the fatal blow? You don't. You don't. You don't. You don't. You, you, Wait, what? You, Hold on. You don't impress. You don't. You don't. You oh, did somebody already? You don't okay, impress okay, okay. me. I was like, I was trying to reward the channel points, and I was like, why is it? What's going on? But it looks like uh, it looks like my mods got you on that. Uh, was that was that four matches we just had? I'm not too sure. I believe was it? We had Belina, then um. Hold on. Yeah, we did. All right. Belina. Uh, okay. Listen, these matches have been pretty fucking crazy so far. Uh, we had just a little slight hold up with Crispy Fungus and Almighty Totonski, but we got them settled. We got their games going. And everything is going smooth. As always, man, thank you so much to everybody tuning in. We got so many fucking viewers. Also, the massive host from Ninja Killer earlier today. And just yep. all the love and support, the, the bits, the, the subs, everything that's been going on today, man. Thank you so much. 
people. You guys have no yeah. understand that shit means the world to us. Yeah. Appreciate you guys. Thank you very much. Uh, so what's going on? Uh, are we going in the next match or? Actually, are we, uh, are we taking a little breather? All right. It looks like I think we are going to take just a second to breathe after some of those matches. We'll be right back in just a moment with the rest of the matches or with some more matches for Champions of the Realms 2 week four. Don't yeah. go anywhere. And if you do. So don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Welcome back, everybody. Champions of the Realms season two, week four. Pools play going down. The action has been pretty crazy so far. Uh, we witnessed a lot of down of the wire sets early on. You know, me and Caboose kind of expected at this point, <laughs> right, Caboose? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, every fucking week we have, there's some match that just has his jaw drop just saying, What's going on, dude? We've definitely come to the point where, you know, every single week, something hype, something ridiculous happens. And so it's not necessarily of no surprise. But we're always excited to bring you guys the hype. And I think this next set is going to bring you guys the hype. Because we got Herbalicious facing off against someone we just saw do some really impressive work with their Terminator, Striker. Oh, yeah. And that, that was one of the matches I was talking about in terms of, you know, down to the fucking wire. You know, mm. seeing Striker just play the mind games with Terminator, go for the mix. It was quite quite something to witness there and dude i gotta yeah. say man just like a visual design here from this terminator like that little uh that hole in his head being able to see the depth and details into that fucking metallic skull is so badass shout out to nrs for the incredible character designs man in this mm -hmm. game they really take attention to detail to a whole nother level absolutely absolutely but all right this match should be a fun one Oh yeah, definitely to, uh, should be. The prediction for you guys. I can't believe you're still setting up the predictions yourself. This is blasphemy. Oh God, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. I'm gonna, don't worry. So I'm Why are you worrying? You. I'm oh, suing you. Why are you worrying so much? I'm suing you. Why are you worrying? You're getting sued. All right, here we go. Wow, Hold game one on. underway. Striker with the Arnold and Kerbalicious with the with the cabal this is two characters uh we kind of we kind of saw coming here be, with these two players oh he tried to kick him out of the air but wait a second kerbalish is very paying a lot of attention to that that anti-air grab that striker has Oh, he's gonna catch nice the throw. From Turbo. The jump back just trying to bait him out here. Oh my god, what a mix up from Kerbalicious. Striker was not ready for that. Taking round number one here. Very good stuff. Yeah, very convincing first round there from Kerbalicious. Going to try and continue the onslaught. Forward 2 2 into the Nomad Dash. Too slow. Too slow. Can anyone? Can anyone? Can anyone? Stop, can anyone stop me? Nice throw there from Kerbo once again. Into the cross up gets caught by the forward two into the Das Boot from Striker there. Das Boot. Four. Das Boot. <laughs> Ooh. Gotta watch out for that back one. Bro, there's a lot of hit. A lot of hit advantages there. He's gonna knock Kerbalicious into the corner. This is such a fast-paced match with a character like Arnold that just 50-50 you like a madman. You gotta be ready for it. The command oh, grab. Beautiful stuff there. A down four into the I'll be backbreaker, and we're all tied up on the rounds. That was so Got good. Spin. That was so good, Caboose. Arnold goes, Got the spins. <laughs> Got the spins. <laughs> Oh my gaki! Oh. Whoa, 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 Arnold, relax, bro. You can take a gaki after the set. Oh my god, he's all over the place. Kerbalicious, trying to look for that opening. He's gonna find it, but didn't commit. The forward two stagger. Oh, what a command grab! Dude, Striker has a fucking hill to climb if he's gonna wanna take this. 
It's not impossible. Oh, he overcommits oh, it's not to the running man. It's, it's impossible now. Yeah, it's uh, <laughs> it's a little impossible now. Yeah, it's impossible and that's now. That's gonna be the end of the game. There, Kerbalicious takes game one. Too slow. Can anyone stop me? <laughs> impossible creatures. All right. It's, impo it's impossible creatures. All right. What is it? Impossible creatures. It's what? Too slow, too slow. Got the spins, got the spins. Too slow, too slow. Got the spins, got the spins, got the spins. Can anyone okay? stop me? You all right there? You, you good, man? You good? That's not me. That's Cabral. It's all, you, like, you're good. Listen. Cabal Sack is literally losing his mind right now. Talking out the ass here. <laughs> The hell are you laughing at? Cabal sack? Oh, man. Don't laugh at his name. I, what? I didn't... Oh, my bad. You're right. My bad. I shouldn't laugh. I shouldn't laugh. <laughs> what if... That's like... I want to paint a picture guys, for everybody. Hold on. What? Go ahead. No, go ahead. Go ahead. Finish your thought, and then let me just... Let me just call out the chat real quick after that. I was going to say, what if Cabal under the mask had balls for chin? Round one. Had a, you can see him had, had, a, had a pair of balls sure. for a chin. Sure. <laughs> He's Peter Griffin? <laughs> Bas Chat. Basically. We already did the channel prediction. What do you think we're going to let you predict when somebody's up 1-0 in the set? These guys. Let them predict. You know what happened? You tried to predict, but you were too slow. Nice Nomad dash there from Kerbalicious. Big combo there. 25%. Even with the breakaway, still good damage for Kerbalicious to get away with. Command grab gonna land. Oh! Oh, you nice saw that, crushing that, blow. That face of pain from Arnold, he's a Man, what a crushing blow combo there for Kerbalicious. Gotta be careful though. All it takes, similar to Sub-Zero, all it takes for Terminator Ooh, is a forward two grab. into fatal. Oh! He's the overhead. He's just backing up here. This is way too close. He's got a Whoa! Oh, that was sick! Bro, oh, he just fucking took it! Oh no, he went for an instant air and that got him punished, Destroyer. That was actually godlike, though. The projectile parry from Arnold. You don't yeah, see it too nuts. often. That was nuts. He said, I eat both. Whoa. Whoa, the respect from both these players just sitting right in front of each other, holding block. Kerbalicious, though, gonna kind of break the stalemate with a throw. With okay. a two throw. He goes for the one, two, one, but what an interruption nice from Kerbalish is gonna counteract him with a crushing blow while got Taka Pintus berries. Oh nah, bro. This cabal is broken. I didn't wanna say it, but I'm gonna say it. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. And he's gonna rip the Terminator in half. Kerbo goes up 2-0. After a ridiculous <laughs> round there, this cabal is absolutely, undeniably, quantifiably <laughs> cabalin. <laughs> cabalin. <laughs> Yo, I thought this man was done with the sentence like <laughs> four words ago. <laughs> <laughs> he should have kept going. That would have been history. <laughs> he should have kept going for like another 20 words, bro. People would have been like, no, he did oh, not. Man. They would have said, no, he did not just go for 20 words. My God. Yeah, this custom cabal, like, I, I'm just, it's unbelievable, man. It is unbelievable what Kerbo was able to do with his character. Striker. Taking a beat, taking a breather. This is what you need to do in a situation like this, I think. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. No. Whoa. We're he, switching out one cyborg for another? He's got a Robocop? Wait a second. A robotness cop being picked here. I don't know. Let's see how this pick is going to go. I, I I mean, I thought, I thought the Terminator was still pretty solid, but it's just, it's really all about trying to slow down trying to shut down Kerbalicious with this uh with this cabal and maybe the zoning is what it's gonna take too slow 
was one of the big things about Robocop, but immediately a whip punish there from Kerbalicious to start off this third game. Hey, one thing I want to mention, though, is that Robocop outfit is fucking badass as hell. Wow, the red with the black, woo! Very nice. He's going to drop it's the combo. all about the cyber name. Oh, my bad. I didn't know. You, you stupid Ooh, idiot. Nice crushing blow. 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 Murphy oil. All over the screen, Murphy oil. But that's going to do it now for Turbo. Look, I love how this guy's name on this variation is, can we please buff term? <laughs> I, I feel like he switched to this to just cry for help at this point. He's trying to, he's trying to send a message instead of fucking play. Yeah, it had nothing to do with, uh, had nothing to do with trying to like actually get a character that switched things up. It was really just about just making a statement. <laughs> nice throw there for Kerbalicious. So far, a flawless round. Oh Playing no! Really well. Oh my goodness! I a mean, raw Nomad dash. This is looking brutal. Wow! And the sweep, the flawless from Kerbo. My goodness. I thought he was gonna go for a mercy, but instead goes for the friendship. Gonna play play him a little tune. And that is gonna be a done deal. Kerbalicious with the 3-0 clean sweep over Striker FGC. Definitely something that I wasn't expecting there, Caboose. That was pretty sick. That was a dominant performance indeed from Kerbalicious. I still want to give a shout out to Stryker. I mean, the, what he did to make it to the point that he did in this tournament with that Terminator was pretty ridiculous. You know, he he himself acknowledges that Terminator still needs a bit of a bit of a boost. So, you know, hopefully he sticks with it. He's he's not out of the tournament. He's going to be sent into the lower bracket. So, who knows? Who knows if we uh, if we end up seeing him in that top 8. That Terminator is pretty nuts. He was making some ridiculous reads the first set that we saw from him. Yeah, you are totally right about that. Well, it's Kerbalicious, that, that cabal, it's it's nuts. Cur that Kerbalicious cabal is delicious. But we're going to be moving on to our next match. It's going to be uh, Kunoichi's Baylina going up against Deadly Rebel. Damn, this is going to be a good one. You know, I think this is going to be a, a, quite the challenge for Baylina here, going up against a collector. If, assuming Deadly Rebel goes with the collector, because... Yeah. I, for one, I think Collector is one of those characters that really falls under the radar. You know, not too many people play with this fucking uh, four-armed freak of nature. And when he does make an appearance on the screen, you know, if you don't got that character knowledge, it is going to be quite troublesome for you. But we're going to find out. We're going to see, yeah. you know, judging by the first games, if Baylina's comfortable against this Collector, if he does go Collector. So I'm excited to see how this plays out, Caboose. Yeah, this should be uh, an exciting match indeed. But I mean, in general, like you got to give it up to Baylina having a pretty damn good run in the tournament so far. She 3 0s Focus Fox. She 3 1s against Achilles. And now here she is, winner's quarterfinal of Pool 1, going up against Deadly Rebel. This has been a hell of a run so far for her. Oh, 100%. And again, I want to say thank you so much to all the players being super cooperative in this tournament, you know, accepting mm -hmm. the invites and just, I seriously love you all. You make the, the fucking experience for me and Caboose so much easier, man. Thank you so much. <laughs> Definitely, yeah. You guys you guys and the support that you do. And as well, like all the all the people that, uh, just like Destroyer said, people who are accepting the invites, being quick with it. We really appreciate that. Helping our tournament run nice and smooth. Bringing you guys the action as quickly as possible. We got the, player, we got the players loaded up. It looks like Deadly Rebel is going to be going with the Collectioner. And Baylina will be sticking with that katana. I mean, the last time we saw that katana, she played so extremely well. So let's see what oh, she's going to be able to do and, and against then, Deadly Rebel. Not only from what we saw, but just judging in the bracket run, you know? She's fucking yeah. popping off with this katana. Mm -hmm. But now this goes to... This is the question I ask. This is the question I ask. Does she have that character knowledge for Collector? That is going to be the big question here. Let's see how this plays out. This is going to be this is gonna be wild. I'm scared. I'm ending the stream. You're into the stream? Oh, okay. All right. Well, ha have a good one, you guys. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Game one underway between Baylina and Deadly Rebel. Let's see what happens. Your regime will need gold. I think the winner of this Wait. moves on to face off against Sosik Nashman. Katana said, I won't rape the poor with tribute. Round one. Fight. Okay. 
she, dude, like, she's basically calling it that Collector is fucking raping people's pockets. You go buy something for Collector, he charges you an arm and a leg. Body. Gotta be careful with that. All right, here we go. In the corner right now, Deadly Rebel landing a pretty sweet combo. Very good stuff here. Oh, blocking the overhead mix up. Baylina trying to catch him with the cheeky stuff. But Deadly Rebel was ready for it. Ready to play. Damn. Big round there for Deadly Rebel. Round two. Fight. See how Baylina's able to answer. Oh, I think she was coming into the whole string to try and avoid the whiff pun. And still got caught though, just because of the sheer range that the collectioner has on his startup. Oh my god, the command grab, and you gotta remember, that is a mid-command grab, super scary stuff. Yo, Deadly Rebel gonna catch her with a cancel. Kinda getting away with murder here. No! That's a punish. This could be the game if Deadly Rebel fully connects the combo, and I believe indeed it will be a good first game there for Deadly Rebel. Now, question is, do we see Baylina switch to Sonya? Or or is Katana kind of the uh, the new main for her? Well, uh, my opinion, I think Katana does fairly well against Collector. I mean, uh -huh. no, no matter what character you pick, you always got to watch out for that mid-range against this character, Collector. Because, you know, one of his biggest tools is his, his mace, his standing for mace. If he starts locking you down with that, and he starts to get in that mind game, you know, that standing for pressure, and he catches you with a command grab, and just all that random shit, once he starts to flow it, and, and you don't kind of, you know, counteract it, it gets troublesome. It gets very troublesome. But like you said, right. Baylina's oh, going to be yep. making that character switch to Sonya Blade. Let's see yep. if she's got that special sauce for Thank Collector with this. Bunker. Oh, that's a nice outfit. Going with that classic... That's right, the MK oh, movie skin. Shit, she said, get this fucking run the Rousey out of my face. <laughs> Yo, I'm hoping when that Mortal Kombat, the new one comes out in April, I'm hoping they do something for MK11 with that. Maybe like we get like a Scorpion and Sub Zero skin or something. I want to see, I want to see what those costumes look like, man. Oh yeah. Look at that, the right, down four immediately to a dash up command grab. Deadly Rebel is really having his way here with that command grab. Beautiful! Nice. Gonna tag him with a crushing blow. Oh, got caught trying to get some sort of counter there off the jump in with the interactable. Baylina now in the corner trying to get out of here. Deadly Rebel just taking a beat and then going for a jump in. It will connect. Oh, this is Another jump rough. in connects. She's just gonna hold block. Not fall for the gimmick. Cancels the second projectile. Didn't get much out of it. Oh, beautiful. Goes with the double stagger there. But oh, man. Deadly Rebel just playing very patient here. Gonna get the neutral jump. And that is gonna be the round. Deadly Rebel going up 1-0 here. And look at that fucking variation name. This is goddamn Jarek. <laughs> Bro, look at Baylina's variation name. <laughs> That's my favorite thing about the custom variation. But it is what people do with that stuff. And down two. Could have gotten the full combo up, but still a, a nice 30%. And a grab gonna connect for Baylina. She has that fatal blow as well. Oh yeah, I feel a lot of a lot of opportunity for comeback here. Oh, no. Oh. But it looks like that is going to be game two going to Deadly Rebel. Unfortunately, Melina now definitely going to have to take a second to think about this. Listen, I got to say right now, I feel, you know, moments that get really down to the wire. It's not over for Sonya Blade just yet. Sonya Blade, I feel like that character has a lot of comeback potential. You know, if she can get the 50-50s going and really open you up for that heavy yep. duty Sonya Blade damage, yep. things might be looking up for her. Let's see what happens here. Melina. Kind of on her last limbs right now. Is she going to be able to turn things around against Deadly Rebel? Or is Deadly Rebel going to be collecting this Sonya Blade? Ew! Ew! Sonya. Don't impress me. <laughs> Photo, relax, man. You're fucking scaring the neighbors. Stupid idiot. You don't impress me. Oh, shit. My bad. My bad.
Total's gotta calm it down, you know? Wait, that's 2-0 or? Yeah, it's 2-0. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep, Deadly Rebel right now up 2-0. Baylina gonna be sticking with the Sonya pick. So let's see how this goes. What's gonna happen here? Game three. It's now or never. Do or die time. Once again, the winner of this moves on to face off against So Sick Nash fan. Yeah, and you know, you, you also gotta think too, man. Uh, we don't know what the extent of of uh, the Katana Baylina's playing. You know, we don't know how long she's been uh, fucking around with the character. So maybe she was just trying to trying to try out Katana. Maybe she's just trying to try out new characters she's working with. Cause that Katana was doing pretty damn well. Oh, goes for the nice short hop kick, but the wake up three from Deadly Rebel and gonna close it out with the forward two to grab. <laughs> what was that? Match point now for Deadly Rebel. Just holding out the bola. Oh, getting interrupted. This is definitely, definitely an uphill battle. Oh, she got the neutral jump, but wasn't close enough to get a punish off of that. Gets caught by another command grab. That command grab doing wonders for Deadly Rebel. And he interrupts, I believe, some sort of wake up. Yeah, this isn't looking too well. Baylina, oh man, she's got a really big life deficit here. She's got to start putting pressure now. And the command oh, grab is not going to do it. Goodness. It's going to do it. Deadly Rebel closing it out 3-0. Sending Baylina to the lower bracket. Good stuff there from Deadly Rebel. My man's just finished Playing it all really well with that collector, and he's just he's, yeah he's going off. He hit it with a silent, wins. the acapella, unbelievable. Oh yeah, you don't you don't got your music on, so nobody hears anything for these kind of uh, for these fr uh, friendships, right? No, yeah, you got to be a nag nodding to hear those instruments. Oh right, 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 That's right, what right. It is. That's the secret tech. Those That's of you who heard the instruments, tech. now you know you're a nag nodding. GGs though, no, GGs. Uh, Baylina still in the tournament. You know, that was a really good set. Let's see who we got next. Okay, Who's so we got next. Up next is gonna be Get Wrecked versus Papa Cap. Papa Cap okay. in your okay. ass. All right. Let me get these invites out. It's been a, a a pretty good week. The way it's rolling right now, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. This top eight is looking like any any anybody's anybody's top eight. I'm here. assuming most of you guys who are here have been following Destroyer for quite some time. But if, in case you haven't been, you gotta make sure you're following Destroyer. Yeah, He's on, also a young god come at on, Warzone. Come and on, man. Come on, man. Too. Follow me, man. Please hey, hey, help hey, me hey. out, man. Follow me, man. Hey, help. come on, man. Hey, can you follow me, please? Jesus, man. Hey, just hey. one, one follow. Hey, just hey. one. All right, then don't follow me. Fuck it, I'll drive. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh, and he, I want to give a huge shout out to uh, Get Wrecked. He's such a great sport. Um, last week, he actually ran into some really bad lag issues against an opponent. So to see him coming oh. back, oh shit. <laughs> Did you literally <laughs> manifest? I hope not. <laughs> but to see him coming back after one win down last week, I want to say thank you so much, Get Wreck. Whipping out the Kung Lao Kung Pao. It looked like he got that clean shave just for today. Let's see what goes down. Put off against the Sub Zero. We all know what uh what Sub Zeros can do. I mean, hell, look at uh look at Papa Caps. Just straight up look at his uh variation name. He even knows. Forward two, idiot. That's it. You're gonna get forward two, and then you're gonna be in the lower bracket, and you're gonna say what happened. You're gonna say what happened to me. That was a nice little corner combo there. From Papa Cap has the corner advantage, but a cross up there from Get Wreck is gonna switch sides. Damn, this pressure right now from Get Wreck. It's too much pressure. Papa Cap hasn't had a chance to move. Oh my god, the hit advantage off of the hat toss. Gonna catch their trade in the air. The low oh slide. my god, a risky slide. Wait a second. Don't count out Papa Cap out just yet. You gotta be so careful right now if you're Papa Cap. Oh, oh we got the low. God, and that's dead. the round. And that's the round. 
That's all it is, Destroyer. A nice little healthy 50-50. I like, too, that Papa Cap he was able to recognize that Get Wrecked was very consistently blocking the overhead, blocking the forward, too. So he was maybe just expecting another over overhead to be thrown out there. I mean, one of the most notorious things you see every Sub-Zero player do when that Fatal Blow is available is that forward two into Fatal Blow. And so in that, Papa Cap was ready to go for the low, went for the back three, it connected, and that's the round. That's a little robbery. Very good stuff. He's gonna tag him with another low. I'm kinda liking this from Papa Cap. Got down to crush out of nowhere. Gonna hit him with an ice ball. Bro, what is so clean about Papa Cap right now is he knows Get Wrecked is so fearful of that forward two. Especially yeah. with the variation in yeah. forward two, idiot. And he's just tagging him with the lows. What a dominant round coming out of Papa Cap here. The down four, wow. gonna close it out. And that's gonna be 1 0 on the board going to Papa Cap. A big first game there for Papa Cap. Definitely sending a message, I'm sure. Get wrecked is absolutely taking a beat to think about what he's gotta do with this, uh, with this Sub Zero. Hey, yo, Destroyer, you wanna know something? What? Did you know that, uh, that Sub-Zero, he's going to be getting his own Jiku flavor? And Scorpion! Did you hear, did you hear about that? And Scorpion, and Scorpion too. Did you know, as well. Did you, did you know that those flavors right now are up for pre-order up on G Fuel's website? No did you know, way. Did you know that if you had exclamation point G Fuel in chat, you can head to a link to pre-order some G Fuel, the Scorpion and Sub-Zero flavors, and, and... Listen, you can use code Caboose Listen, to check I out. know that, and I want to mention right now to the chat, you know, now is a... Perfect time to support Caboose in, in, in something not only that is going to show appreciation to his sponsor, G Fuel, but to him as well. And this is, a, I think this is going to be limited. I'm not, don't quote me on it, but these are possibly limited time Mortal Kombat flavored G Fuel cans. Now, even if you don't like G Fuel, if you're a fan of Mortal Kombat, you need to fucking get these shits because just to hang up these badass MK G Fuel cans in your room or wherever... It's gonna be oh, like yeah. a, a really cool collector's item, you know? Yep, yep. Like, I'm gonna you get, you yeah. get the collector's box, you can get some a shaker cup with a Mortal Kombat. Oh logo. my I'm god, dude. Saying. I'm just saying. I'm gonna try to get my hands on that shit, Code Caboose, just so I can hang that shit up in my room, you know? You know what it is. And, brother, pour, you and, know pour, what it is. and pour it in my eyes. <laughs> get right. <laughs> gonna be switching over to the Johnny Cage, which so far has been doing pretty well for him at the start of this match. Gotta be, you know, this is this is exactly what you need against the Sub-Zero. You need yeah. to just never let them have a turn. And that's something that Johnny Cage is very good at. Applying an insane amount of pressure to never allow your opponent the opportunity to get some hits in. Doing a really good job. Not even have to worry about blocking any mix-up. As it was pretty much all offense. He avoids the amplified ice ball and gets a nice punish off the jump in. Get Rex playing very well so far in game two here. Top eight down one though. Oh, the last hit of that of that back one gonna connect. Very good stuff. Papa oh, Cap. Dude. And uh, dude, I love how Papa Cap is just gaining. He's he's just keeping his composure. He's not getting too carried away here. Even though Get Reg just fucking un unleashed hell on him. He's just real chill about it. Beautiful anti-air. I'm loving Nicely this stage done. right now, man. We got the champions of the realms mascot floating around in the yeah. background here. I got a different one, but I'm looking at the stream and I see that that's the one that's popping up for you. And it looks like Get Wrecked is going to tie this set up with a really solid game using this Johnny Cage. Going to sign the screen for us. Thank you very much, Johnny. Yeah, I'm going to have to get a new monitor because that's fucked up. He just rolled all over my shit, bro. He rolled all over my monitor. Johnny and permanent marker. Son of a bitch. Hey, yo, Salted Peanut. Thank you very much for the gifted sub. Much appreciated, brother. You guys have been ridiculous with the support tonight. I'm absolutely blown away. Thank you to everybody. 1,100 people watching live. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What? We got a mirror? Oh my god. A Johnny Cage mirror? I do not believe. Wait, in the same outfit? No, that was not real. What's going hold on? on? Hold on, Was that the same outfit as well? It was. It no was. Way. No way. No, no way. way. No, no way. way. No way. No way. No way. Fight. He's gonna give uh, Papa Cap the player two colors. Of course, because they're all in the same skin. Damn, shit just so got Papa real. Cap, Papa Cap in that like uh, darker gray, almost uh, black looking suit. 
get wrecked in the blue suit, the blue tux, I should say. Wait, is that 1-1 one, one, or is that 2-1 for a get wrecked? That's 1-1. One, one. You sure? Yeah, because get wrecked switched to Johnny and won that next game. And oh, now I know, I know, got I know, pushed I know. over to Johnny Cage. You got to get it together. Hey, listen, man. Right now, I'm, <laughs> I'm making sure Spanky Doodle is, is under control. Oh, the trade on the projectile. That was sick. Nice okay. flawless block on the secondary uh, projectile there, and another flawless block. Could just neutral duck them, but it's okay. I don't think. Minimal chip damage. I don't think Papa Cap wants to get into this zone war here. Wow, he tagged him twice, but both times get wrecked was airborne, kind of fucking up the uh, conversion from Papa Cap. Yeah, especially on the first attempt there, he had the uh, fatal blow cancel. Ooh, the Got fatal blow back though. Again. And get wrecked is jumping at the perfect time, and he's gonna take that round. All right, here we go. Next round underway. Fight. Oh, that's a punish there on the whip. The jump in or cross up attempt there from Get Wrecked and now has the corner, wake up roll. Good throw. Good throw. Fuck it, I'll drive. <laughs> Oh no, Papa Cap gonna open him up. Look at this juggle. Beautiful combo. Oh my god, 34%. Tries to go for the grab, but get wrecked. Trying to get aggressive here. Oh, he get, the jump in, but get anything out of oh, it. It's on. gonna hurt quite a bit. Nope, he broke away. Break away immediately, yeah. I was expecting maybe the, uh, the glasses toss. Oh my god, not like oh, this. Oh, that's the game. And that is the game. Get Rex goes up 2-1 in the set now. Does Papa Cap stick with the Johnny Cage? I don't know. I feel like maybe the Sub-Zero was still a better choice. Yeah, there was a lot of pressure in the in the first game that Get Rex switched over to the Johnny Cage. But I think it was just, you know, maybe trying to get used to the, uh, to the matchup. I think at the end of the day, that 50-50, once you can start getting it going, it's unstoppable. Yeah, right now, going up two to one. Get wrecked against Papa Cap. We saw Papa Cap had a pretty ridiculous Sub-Zero. You know, the Johnny Cage kind of going toe-to-toe -to -toe with, with Get Wrecked to an extent. But now we're going to see him making a character switch to Shang soon. This was something I totally did not see coming, Caboose. Wow. Shibu and shibu and pipe 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 Oh my goodness. All right, here we go. Game four underway. Oh, yes. Thank you for mentioning the Macherino. Guys, if you want to contribute to the prize pool, it's almost at $2,000 fucking dollars. Exclamation point Macherino in the chat to get situated with that. Indeed. We appreciate every single one of you who's donated the Macherino already to get it to where it is. And as well, a big thank you to Console Gaming League, the sponsor of this tournament, for committing $1,000 to that prize pool. Thank you very much. Nice neutral duck there off the throw. That was some uh, that was some MKX stuff there. The uh, the restand on the nut punch. Trying to go for just uh, some extra little bit. Can't really do uh, he's, he's not he's not MKX Johnny, that's for sure, but Johnny Cage is still such a solid character in this game, and right now Get Wrecked has his corner control. Papa Cap though with that fatal blow. Needs just one hit wow. conversion, but gets caught with the throw off that wake up roll and get wrecked. Now match point. And hit him with a fucking triple fuck you back to back. Say fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, dude. Fuck you. Too slow. Oh my god, knocking him out of the air. Papa Cap is in trouble. Nice. Gonna hit him with the hell sparks. Okay. Catches him again with the soul steal. Soul steal. Listen, he should have stayed with the fucking mirror if he's gonna do this shit. I was gonna say, I mean, <laughs> he did play as Johnny, so he kind of is already familiar with the matchup. The soul steal kind of works in this instance. It does. It does. Oh my God! Shadow kick from downtown. Wow. Great flawless block two on the ground eruption. So far, it has been very hard for Papa Cap to try and get a handle on the pressure that Get Wrecked has been applying, tossing the tough cotton. Oh, fatal blow available. This is big. Okay, crushing blow. Big crush. Oh, oh no. Oh. Oh. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No way. And the cross up punish. That's gonna be it. Get wrecked. Takes the set three to one. Johnny Cage wins. Damn, after a really solid game from Papa Cap with that sub zero, Get Wrecked makes the switch to Johnny Cage and is able to maintain those next three games to take the win. The pressure was just too much, Destroyer. Yeah, that was way too much pressure going on right there. Get Rex staying composed, taking that set, closing it out, sending Papa Cap to the lower bracket. Very yep. good stuff. Very good plays from Get Rex. Uh, that was that was a really good set, you know, in the beginning. It was like layers to that set. In the beginning, Papa Cap, he was going ham with the fucking mix-up from Sub-Zero, but, you know, Get Rex, he just kind of flipped a switch and kind of turned things around. Very good stuff. Very good stuff indeed. Great set there for Get Wrecked. Still some good stuff from Papa Cap. I mean, you know, it's uh it's it's not easy to deal with that kind of that Johnny Cage pressure. Uh oh Striker, Striker, uh Mary Luna, Mary Luna, get in contact with Striker, please. He needs to uh get a, a somebody DQ'd. Get him DQ'd for him. DQ the fucking guy for him, please. And you know what? DQ the next three opponents for him. Send him the grand finals, please. Jesus. You know what? Give him tres leches. Give him the tres leches. No. Relax. I'm kidding. Are you going to get the... Okay, okay. I'm whoa, kidding, whoa, okay? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm kidding. Jesus. Relax. Relax. Destroy it. I'm kidding, man. You you, you, you take it overboard a little bit, man. It's like, not you me. Just, I'm it's not, too much. I'm not taking it overboard. Yo, but up All next, right. we got a good one. What do we got? We got... Luna versus Luna. Listen, this name right here, this is I don't I want to know right now if anybody knows who this is in the chat. This guy goes by the name Rewind Stinks. Like what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? That's what I'm saying. Is this Rewind What's that or? about? <laughs> I I'm serious. Like I'm not even trolling. This is what this guy's fucking name is. Uh I I don't know if this guy's like out here trying to troll or what? I mean, I hope that's rewind. Otherwise, that's a little lame to like. You yeah, know? yeah, that is. That's that's kind of disrespectful. I'm not gonna lie, but uh, hopefully it's somebody that's cool with rewind, you know. And hopefully I this, hope so. I, I'm just hoping this isn't a, a name that's like literally like seriously sending hate towards rewind because that'll just be super lame. But I'm gonna have the benefit of the doubt, and we're just gonna assume that this guy is cool with uh, rewind. Here's um, open. Here's open. Okay, let's get these invites out. Dude, I'm not even trolling. That's the guy's name. Go hit exclamation point bracket. Like, should we ban this guy for this name? I'm nervous. Are you nervous? You look, you look nervous. Yeah, I'm kind of nervous. I'm not going to lie. You, you look nervous. Oh, shit. Bro, I'm not going to lie. I feel like Ninja Killer would literally have to diminish his skills to not look like Ninja Killer. Like... The motherfucker's so good, you you kind of know when he's on the screen, you know? When you start seeing flawless blocks from left to right, and you see the fucking game moving at a pace you don't usually see it move at, then you know something fishy's going on. But we are about to see Ludi FGC going up against Rewind Does Not Stinks. We'll see how this goes down. It's weird because I just want to say, like, we we got Ludi facing off against Rewind, but I don't. That's that might not be Rewind. So, <laughs> like you have to, you, like it feels like I'm I'm pressured into saying the full name. So like you're a shithead. Uh, 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 what do I do? Uh, uh, do I say Rewind stinks or do I say he doesn't stink? How do I how do I commentate? How do I commentate this match? What an anti air there. Wait, was that some Ninja Killer shit he just did? <laughs> was that some ninja killer shit he just did? Just be honest. I don't be know. Honest I guess we're gonna have to see. You, you need to see a little more to, to confirm. If if this is ninja killer, that's pretty wild. I'll tell you what. If he flawless blocks ten times in this match, it's ninja killer. True, true. So somebody get the counter. Down one's trading back and forth. Ooh, that that he was looking for a whiff punish there. Ludi needs to be Ooh, careful. Well, some people are saying it might be K7. What? 
That's right. A7 does I have a, a crazy rain as well. Yeah, but I don't know. Like, are, are, are these people, like, are they close enough friends with Rewind to, to make, like, an account like this? We'll find oh, out, man. Like we'll find out. I'll actually, uh... Avoided? That's a big punish! No the one three in the fatal blow! Not like this. Rewind is gonna take... Rewind... Dude, I can't say anything. Is gonna take it <laughs> with the fatal blow. And yo, that... You saw He just splashed the fucking water in his face. Please tell me y'all just saw that. All right, all right. I don't... I don't... I think Ninja Kill is trolling in the chat saying that it is him. So I don't think it's him, or maybe I don't. I have no idea what's happening. I'm I'm getting up. <laughs> <laughs> you know who knows? Nice. Yo, you know Big who knows the out. answers? Who? Jerick. Let's ask Jerick. Yo, Jerick. Is this Ninja Killer? No, 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 no. I want to know if this is Ninja Killer. No, is this Nin? Jerick. Jerick. <laughs> Listen to me, Jerick. Do you know how to talk English? I'm done. Oh my I'm god. Done. I'm done. Nice. Good throw there from Luda. Trying to take this round and tie things up. Oh, into the forward two. And he's going to get the 1 1 1 to tie things up here. Damn, this is intense, bro. Rewind stinks, aka the fake ninja killer, aka Deoxys, aka K7. This is everybody. After every combo, they switch, they pass the controller to the other player. <laughs> <laughs> I thought my soundboard was broken. <laughs> Crushing blow there from Luda. Trying to close this round out, trying to take this game. Oh, nice anti air there with oh, stand one. Oh, shit. Air projectile. Wow. And Rewind thinks is going to lose round one. Good stuff there from Ludi taking game one. Okay, now I'm a little, I'm a little <laughs> tilted. Ninja Killer is killing me in chat right now. <laughs> he said, "Okay, I'm about to switch." Yo, <laughs> if this motherfucker switches, the mix-up right now in the chat is gonna be pretty big. Yeah, oh it's me. God. It's me playing right now. I'm using my fucking feet. <laughs> I'm using my feet to control this match. Hold on, let me let me actually pick up the controller. Island. Damn, it's we didn't not, even get to the bottom of this, man. Who, not, whose hiding is this? It's not whose ninja, hiding is not this? Ninja Killer. He didn't switch. No, it's not Ninja. Could it be K7? Some people were saying K7. All right, we're launching Could a full a, investigation right now. Yeah, you we're know what? I we're think, launching I a think full it's my investigation. Steve. I think it's I think it's Steve. Go my to his house. Go to his house and check. Here's a blazer. Okay, Ninja said I meant switch variations. Okay, okay, okay. Keeping up the illusion, I see. It's Larry Wheels. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay. Nice throw there from Ludi. Oh, good stuff absorbing those projectiles. Still though, Ludi gonna be getting a big combo off of this one. Yeah, beautiful. Man, 35%. Oh my god, the pickup with the leap. That was beautiful stuff. But oh, wait a second. Rewind stinks right now. Trying to make a comeback here. He's gonna catch him with a double side switch combo. Oh, my. Yo, this oh, is looking god. juicy. Oh shit! The empty oh, jump into the throw. Oh my god. Shit. The magic pixel comeback? Wait! Oh. What? Ow. Wow! How? Listen, whatever, whoever Ow. this is, I don't know. But that was an insane Ow. comeback. Oh, and the armor breaker crushing blow. Okay, wait a second. This motherfucker knows what he's doing. A lot of pressure on the screen here. Gonna put Ludi in the corner. Rewind stinks is pissed. Wait a second. Ludi gonna get the down back four. Bro, the nice back throw. and forth between these two players is actually unreal right now. This is quite the set we are witnessing here, folks. Wait, people are saying it's Sonic? No way. No way. No way. No way. No way. I feel like if it was Sonic, we'd be seeing a lot more wave dashing coming out of a character like Rain. Yeah, you think so? 
I feel like it. Oh, oh, oh and the back to one. It lands into Fatal Blow. I believe this is the game. Huh. And that me, it all up. Me, me and Caboose are more focused on finding out who this is than paying attention to the fucking set. Uh, who is this guy? Uh, who is this Sonic? Fox is rewind. Who is this guy? Uh, Ninja Killer. Some people are saying not sweaty enough to be Sonic, but uh, uh, did you see guy? that Magic Pixel comeback? That was sweaty. Did you see that Magic that Pixel comeback? That was sweaty. I don't know. That was sweaty. I don't know. I'm talking like he's sitting in a puddle of sweat right now. In his room, he's got to get a fucking drain to drain that shit out. All that sweat in the room. Sweat tea. Can I get a sweaty in the chat for the one time, please? People are, like, convinced that this is on. Yeah, I don't think so, bro. How do we How do we know? How does everyone... Why is everyone saying that so confidently? I'm going to call him up right now. I'm going to call him up. Yo, Sonic Fox. Whoa, don't yell at me. Don't yell at me like that. Is this you? Wow, he hung up. I don't know. I don't know. We don't know. You? We don't know. I don't. He hung up on me. We don't know. They hung up on you. Oh my goodness. He hung up on me. Oh, the anti-air into oh, the armor, no breaker. armor breaker. Twice back to back reads. Gonna hit him with a disgusting combo. A near 30% in the corner. Try to catch him. Oh! oh! Bro, imagine that. Trying to whiff punish, but instead you catch a crushing blow. Wait, why do people tell me to check the ping? Their ping is pretty much identical. Does that, does that confirm it? What? Oh my goodness. The raw nomad dash. He drops it. Rewind stage. Very close. Bro, I can't watch. He's gonna throw the guitar. Ludi better not. He better not pull the trigger on that on that fatal oh blow. He's nice gotta be throw. patient about it. Oh shit! Rewind Sting does have the life lead here. What's he gonna go with? Air projectile. Oh, the down oh, one. Goodness. Fuck you, overhead. Oh, nice, oh. he's gone. We have to get to the bottom of this. I honestly don't care anymore, man. <laughs> Good pressure. Goes with it again, but gonna drop the combo this time. No! What a read. Yo. What? Oh my god. Bro. Back 2 1 2 connect. Oh, look at the pressure. Oh, knocking him out of the air with the string. Very good knowledge there. It's cross up. Oh my goodness, that air dash is so nuts. Back to open him up. So yeah, back to one. Oh my god, they're down, down two from Ludi. Oh Bro, what is going oh. on? He rolls out, no punish. Ah! The air dash connects. Is, is he dead? That, around? that yes, is the round. Indeed. That is the round. Holy smokes. Tied one apiece. Looty versus Rewind Stinks. What, what a, a battle. Dude, what a fucking Ooh. battle. Catches the crushing blow. Beautiful stuff. Dude, that would have been the read if he did it a second yeah. later. That, uh, by all, for all intents and purposes, that was a read. Oh my god, just taking a step back here. Ludi. Ooh! Catching the projectile with the whatever the hell you call that shit. The the rip. Yeah. The projectile there. Ludi. Trying to close this out. Oh, what an eruption! Oh my god. Throw it gonna catch him with the grab. Oh yeah. Confirmed. One little hit confirmed. Is this Back death? to one in the fatal blow. Is this death? death? It's gonna be close. I think it's gonna be I close. think it might leave him at pixel, Caboose. I think it might leave him at pixel. Oh, it is Holy magic pixel. Fuck! He almost oh. had the win but the kicks are gonna connect! Rewind stinks going up two to one! Oh my god! Bro, okay, is it I me? It's not it's not K7. K7's in the chat, very active during the match. Bro. It's not K Who is this? I don't fucking know, but bro, is it me? 
or does every week just get crazier and crazier the intensity is just rising through the roof the closer we get to this finale caboose i can't take it i can't take it much longer all right all right, all right chat Rain. it's time it's time i admit something Come on. i entered the tournament it's me <laughs> fuck out of here <laughs> <laughs> let's not add to this confusion <laughs> Everybody else is already going crazy here. Oh <laughs> Caboose just comes straight out. All right, everybody. It's me. <laughs> While commentating, being super hype and shit. This man is just a night. You're like fucking Yoda. You're like fucking Chancellor Palpatine. Yeah, exactly. You know how it is. We're going to switch cameras. He's going to look like a fucking dead zombie. I'm going to say, yo, what the hell? You say infinite power. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Okay, wait, this might be Sonic. <laughs> Alright, don't get carried away here. Let's not get carried away here. We, can't, we can't confirm. We can't confirm until we clarify. Until we get the that facts. Was a read and a half there off the start of that game. Yo, oh my god. The abuse in this corner right now. Oh Ludi. my god. Ludi's in trouble. Match point for uh for rewind stinks. <laughs> You said rewind Skaki stinks? What? I didn't say nothing. I didn't say anything. Oh, like the down four. Wait a second. Try to catch him with the back one, but the, the fucking interactable out of nowhere. Oh, good anti air. Luna! Yo, Luna gotta wake up. Good grab. Forward throw there off the empty hop. He goes for the back one, stagger into an instant air buzzsaw. Was that the right move? Wait a second, Rewind Stink's gonna open him up. The grab! Dude, he is on match point, Caboose. Like, literally one more touch and it's gonna be a GG's. The commentator's curse that we know, we know what's, uh, what you've done before with that commentator's curse. Oh, we'll try no. to dash in! Oh, and dead. that's gonna be a big conversion! I think that's it. Yeah, I that's think it. That's, that's, it. that's it. That might be it, and that's I believe it. it will be, and it that's looks it. like Rewind Stink's who oh, might be funny GGs. is moving on beating Ludi. Wow. I need I we need some sort of call. We need some somebody to, to figure this out and get to the bottom of this and confirm it for us. Listen, I don't know what the case may be, but this dude finishing it off with a fatality and everything, sending a message. Very good stuff. Rewind Stings taking it three to one over Luna. Luna. Damn, dude. Um, Yo, big stuff there, though. A lot of predictions in the chat. Someone said it's John Cena. Someone <laughs> said it's Evolvo. Somebody said it's Yo. Spanky Doodle. I think it's Spanky Doodle. That might be one of the, the, the top predictions. Yo, if it's but Spanky, Doodle, Spanky Doodle better not be talking shit about Rewind. He better not be. But, dude, that, that's really cool. Um, I think it's kind of hype. Like, even though this man is doing some scumbag shit, coming in here with a Heidi account and just wrecking fools, I think it's hype. When you get that that player, because it's very reminiscent to remember Larry Wheels. I don't know if you guys remember Lerf, uh, Lerfic Pegend. <laughs> Anybody <laughs> remember that one? Like, players like that, like, I feel like that is just the ultimate spice to the tournament sometimes. And, hey... Fucking Rewind Stinks coming in here with the heat. Putting in some fucking work, man. Wow. That was that was a ridiculous rain. Like, there's really no two ways around it. There were some great plays made during the entirety of that set. I still can't get over that ridiculous, ridiculous Magic Pixel comeback. Yeah. Uh. So, I think we're actually going to be moving into our top 16 matches for tonight. It looks oh, like... Yeah, it looks like everything is uh, everything is to that point. Sick. Wait, uh, let me just. Sure? Well, kind of, because we. We're still waiting for get wrecked and crazy. Yeah, no, no, no. But what what we'll do is uh, we'll start we'll with pool. Like we'll start with pool number four, and then by the time okay. that's done, we should have all the other uh, top sixteen matches right. ready to go. But okay. I want to give a huge shout outs as always, man everybody tuning in thank you so much we have a crap ton of viewers tonight what are we at 1300 fucking viewers man for Nuts. the champions of the realm season two week four pool play 
I want to give a huge shout out to you guys watching. Huge shout out to the competitors, you know, showing up to the bracket, competing, making this show what it is. You know, without the competitors, without the viewers, this would be an empty wasteland with me and mm-hmm. Caboose just talking into the shadows, talking to the, the nether realm souls, the lost souls of the nether realm. And as always, huge shout outs to Console Gaming League providing a, what is it? $150 uh, prize pool for each week. Each and every week. And a yeah. and $1,000 into the finale prize pot. Speaking of, we are at almost $2,000 for the finale prize pot. Shit is actually crazy. No, you guys are nuts. Like, we, we say thank you a lot, but honestly, like, from the bottom of our hearts, we mean it. Uh, to everybody that watches Champions of the Realms, whether you're watching here live or if you're watching on Destroyer's YouTube channel, that's always amazing. The support that you guys show for us day in, day out, each and every week for Champions of the Realms with Season 1, now into Season 2, has been amazing. We have had an absolute blast putting this tournament together. It's been so much fun. And the, seriously, seriously, thank you. Thank you to everybody to donating yes. to Match Reno, to watching all the people who gifted subs and stuff like that today. You guys are incredible. But all right, as we get ready for these top 16 matches, we're going to go into another break. And then we'll get we'll be right back with the top 16 matches, which is going to be really intense because those will be the games that send you into the winner side of the top eight that will be taking place this Friday. Don't go anywhere, guys. We'll be right back. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Champions of the Realms 2, week four. We brought you the action so far with the pool play, some really intense matches, and somebody with a Heidi account that everybody's really trying to figure out oh who that God. is. Oh my God! We're gonna we're gonna launch a full FBI investigation on that. Don't worry. We're gonna we're gonna get to the bottom of that and try and figure some things out. But right now we are jumping in to our top 16 matches. As I mentioned right before we went into the break, these are the matches that are gonna determine who makes it into the top eight for this Friday on the winners' side. Also worth mentioning, top eight. Friday, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Oh, you guys boy. better be there because it's going to be hype. Yeah, and especially if this Rewind Stinks ends up getting into that top eight, I think that is really going to, like, scramble things oh, up. Oh, man. That's going to be like the atomic bomb just dropped into the middle of everything. You know, you're on a Heidi account. You made it into yeah. the top eight. You got nothing to lose. You got yeah. nothing to lose. I don't even think money's a fucking thing at this point. You're just here to, to, to ruin people's days. But Definitely stir up some questions. And, oh, uh, yeah. and, I, and I wonder, I, you know, it would be cool, too, if whoever that is that's running that Heidi account just doesn't re- reveal themselves. You know, they, they get into the top eight and they still keep that secrecy. You know, then, then that'll make it really interesting. But we'll see. It'll be insanity. Yeah. You know, but coming up next, we're going to have a pretty juicy match, uh, like Caboose mentioned, for the top 16 here. It's going to be Tsunami fgc going up against zork uh i'm not too sure if i'm correct here but if i'm not mistaken both these players play jackie briggs and if that's the case holy oh, shit are we gonna see a shit show i think we're gonna oh, see jackie man. briggs flying all over the screen plasma balls everywhere i may be wrong i may be wrong but that is what i'm thinking is gonna go on here as we await be- tsunami yeah, we're just waiting up for Tsunami. <clears throat> Zork is in the lobby. Yeah, if anybody so, can get in contact with Tsunami, please let him know his match is up to get in here so we can get this action on the row. As soon as Tsunami, I wonder if we're going to have ourselves a Jackie Mirror match. That would be pretty nuts. Here we go. <laughs> Impressed. Me. Okay, nice. I already set up the prediction. I was just about to set it up for you guys. There we go. Yo, big shout out to the mods, by the way. Thank you, everybody, to, 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 the, to my mods. Big shout outs. Can we get some love in the chat for my mods? Doing a great job setting up the predictions for you guys right away. Hooking it up. Much appreciated. You guys are the best. Ooh, so sick Nash fan pulling out this Sindel, man. Every time I see this man whip out the Sindel, I start getting... uh. PTSD flashbacks of that forward four. The forward four. <laughs> yeah. Forward four of the realms. <laughs> forward or four of the, the realms. Four. Champions, Champions of the forward, of the forward four, four is what we're about to witness here. <laughs> Let's see what's going to go down. Round Get wrecked. Four. Going Sorry. with the Liu Kang. Interesting. Go for that jump in and immediately goes for that forward one, two. Lands it into the bicycle kick. Spends both meter. I thought you were going to say forward four. 
Forward four, yeah. Lands, uh, lands that double amplification. One more away from uh, having that cartoon blow locked and loaded. Nicely done. The amplified stream and then the overhead connects. A good tech on the throw there. There's that forward four. How many forward fours we got going on here? Oh my goodness. A lot of them, Destroyer. A lot of them. Tries to go for the low mix up, but nothing's home. Get Wreck has a big life deficit. Great Gonna punish. hit him with a flying kick. Dude, the back and forth right now between these two players. Oh. He's gonna stomp on her back. Oh. Oh my god. Yeah, full strength. He gets oh. the back one, and that's gonna be the round. The robbery right before our eyes. I cannot believe we just witnessed that caboose. Beautiful stuff there from Get Wreck. That's what he's all about. Liu Kang, the name of the game for Liu Kang since day one with MK11 has been those staggers. It's been the pressure that that character can apply when you're holding that block button. Dude, I literally got people DMing me on Twitter asking me whose rewind stinks. I don't, I don't fucking know. How am, I, how am I supposed to know? Don't DM me asking me that shit. Oh, he went for the command grab. And now get wrecked. Holding this corner. There's that one more amplification. Crushing Glow locked and loaded. All he needs is one more bicycle kick. He could potentially close out this game off of a conversion here. Let's see if it's going to happen. Ooh, maybe an input error? Not sure if he meant to break away, but Get Wrecked has a life lead. Wants to close this out, oh I imagine. Oh my god, the command grab! Big command I grab. forgot he had that in his arsenal, man. Oh, oh, oh. wow. What in this variation of Liu Kang, uh, Get Wrecked's bringing to the table here? literally has everything command grabs 50 50s and mix-ups out the ass so sick nash man's gonna be he's gonna have to play on his toes here definitely gonna have to be playing on his toes absolutely great first game there for get wrecked gonna tighten the headband let me i'm gonna tighten my headband too i'm driving make sure you don't let out a little fart if you tighten it too tight whoa hey oh if you if you put up your volume, if you put up your volume, you, you actually hear it in Liu Kang's end. He lets out a little squeak every time he tightens it. If, if you too didn't know, for him, yeah, it's a little too much, like a little too much work for him, huh? Yep. He's got to be careful. But all right, here we go into game two. Right now, get wrecked up 1-0 against Sosik Nash fan. Always got to be careful though. So sick, Nashman, especially with the Sindel. That character is still pretty ridiculous. Oh, but the forward four will connect. Four get wrecked. Very good stuff. So sick, Nashman kind of has corner positioning here, but slowly but surely, get wrecked fighting his way out. Good scream. The zoning from So Sick Nash Man. This is looking pretty, pretty juicy here. Nice oh. anti-air. Yo, and uh, the bro, the pool just updated for pool three, and it looks like we're gonna be seeing Kerbalicious versus Rewind Stinks for the, oh, pool, three, for the pool three top 16. That's gonna be intense. Oh my God, that's gonna be um, intense, dude. Yo, hijinks in chat, hit up, uh, hit up Mary. Mary is the admin for Smash CD. Um, so just hit her up and, and see if she can help resolve the uh, the issue you're running into right on? now. What's What's the issue? We're just sitting here commentating. We can't do much on our end, unfortunately. But a nice round win there for Get Wrecked. It's true. Not me. Round two. Fight. Big crushing blow there. Whoa, what the hell was that? I don't know. But he's trying to get the, he gets the down two for the extra damage. The guaranteed damage. Empty jump in. Straight into a grab and a scream. <laughs> you cut off for me for a second there, so all I heard was the end of that. That shriek. Oh, big crushing blow there with the stream. Nicely done. Amplifies huge combo off the crush. And the air flip will do it. Listen, a lot of people ask me how am I able to scream like Sindel? Well, yeah. I'm her father. Huh? I'm Sindel's father. Oh my god. 
Oh, what a down two! Go for another down two. Time to go for the low, the low projectile. Standing four. Another low projectile from Stosig Nash fan. Both of them connecting to, to the toes. Very good stuff here. But Get Rex still has a light lead, and that's gonna wow. do it. The fly kick gonna close it out. Get Rex going up 2 0 oh on so sick forward four. I mean, Nash fan. Whoa. Oh, oh, oh. Wait. got mixed up a little bit there. So sick, who? Huh? No, 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 no. Don't say that. Don't what say that? that. What happened? What are you? Don't everything say okay? That. Go, yo, 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 hold me back. Yo, 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 hold me back. Hold me back. It, yo, 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 I didn't yo, call hold security. Me back, hold me back. What? Hold me back. Sure, you good? What's I, I didn't call it, guys. I didn't call security. Down there. I don't. I don't know what the hell is happening with this guy. I have no. I have no idea what's happening here. But okay, we're gonna be going into game three. Get wrecked right now. Playing so well with this Liu Kang pick. Sindel. Nash fan gonna be sticking Liu with that Sindel. Kang. It's do or die time. Remember, guys, this is a top sixteen so match. If, that, if Get Wrecked is able to win this next game, he'll be moving on to the top eight on that winner's side. That is such a huge advantage to go into the top eight, which will be taking place this Friday, six p.m. Eastern Standard Time, right here, Twitch.tv. And you know what else, Destroyer? You know what else? What? You know what else? What? Let me let me tell you. Let me tell you what else. They got Mortal Kombat G Fuel coming out, and you can go hit exclamation point G Fuel in the chat and use code Caboose at checkout. Are you serious? Are you serious? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Are you serious? Oh, I'm dead serious. Oh, whoa. Oh, nice take throws. That was an interesting tech there. I mean, just for the simple fact that Liu Kang is, is capable of doing shit like that, it makes his pressure so much crazier. Yeah. Like, come on, bro. I got to worry about this dude staggers, and now I got to worry about a fucking tick throw that comes out of a standing one. Like, excuse me? Excuse me. Hello? Hey, yeah? Oh, Sorry, I was on a wait a minute. He's oh. got to go. He's got to spend it. He's got to spend it. I think that's round. He's got to spend it. Round. He's got to yep. spend it. Yep. Big round win there for so sick Nash fan. The crushing blow into the fatal blow. Very good stuff, man. And look at that. The Wraith coming out of Sindel screaming for some fucking leche. Oh, the armor breaker. Dude, so sick Nash fan is really tightening up here. He is down 2-0 against Get Wrecked. So he's got to be playing this clean if he wants to make this comeback happen. Good grab. Nicely done off the back one. Big combo there for Get Wrecked. A flawless block. So sick Nash fan. Maybe wake it up, Destroyer, but a great combo from Get Wrecked. Trying to close out this round, send himself into match point position. Oh, the throw gets ducked into wow. an immediate punish. Match point for Get Wrecked. I cannot believe he's going to close that out. And you're right about that. Match point out of nowhere, too. Get Wrecked kind of just, you know, taming the beast that is Sindel. Oh my god, what a read and a half. And wow. the armor breaker grab. Relax, Get Wrecked. Relax. Oh, no. The crushing oh, blow no. gonna explode the face. Look at this combo. Oh my goodness, 43%. There was nothing to break away from. That's gonna hurt as well into the restand. And that'll be the game. The pressure was just unbelievable there. And Get Rex will be moving on to the top eight. Bro, it couldn't have gotten more dominating than that. Holy shit. Did Get Rex pop the fuck off right there. Very that good stuff. Unreal. It really was, but so sick Nash fans still in this, so don't give up hope just yet. Going down to the lower bracket where he's gonna have to fight for his life against a bunch of killers. <laughs> you know, I hate to put it like that, but that's that's what's gonna happen. That's what's gonna happen. <laughs> that is what's gonna happen. But hey, so sick Nash fans still such a capable player. That Sindel is still so crazy. You do not want to sleep on him. For sure, you just got to watch out for that Sindel. Watch out for those forward fours. Big game, though, for Get Wrecked. Our first, con or our first competitor making it into the top eight for this Friday. Yeah, and I know we're kind of all over the place uh, running these top 16 matches, starting with pool one, starting with pool four. So we apologize for that, but yeah. we are moving on to pool four next. Tsunami is ready, and okay. he's going to be going up against Zork.
Yeah, all right, so we're getting that match set up officially now. The tsunami is ready to go. Wait, what and, was, uh, uh do you remember what Zork's PSN was? Uh, I think I got it. 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 Yeah, it was. You got you're, it. You're right. You got you're right. It. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you? I think you got it. Did I got you get it? it? I got it. I got it. You got it. You got it. Do you? You know? Yeah. Do you know, know what it is? It. Invites. You invites are sent. Invites are sent. You got it. Did yeah. You get it? All right. All right. This should be a good one. Um. So this was the Jackie Briggs mirror we were expecting in the beginning yeah. that we didn't end up seeing. But right. now that we are gonna finally be seeing it. It, it should be interesting and i'm saying jackie briggs mirror because if you do go on the smash.gg website uh these players do have the option to enter what character they ended up using for the set so mm -hmm. you, you can kind of get a gist of of who they played with you know and just judging by the bracket it looks like tsunami went all jackie briggs and the same goes for zork all jackie briggs so i think oh, we're man. i think we're definitely going to be seeing the mirror here unless one of these players aren't comfortable with the mirror and they go with the character switch based off of that. Yeah, this should be interesting. I mean, I know everyone has their opinions about Jackie Briggs, but this is definitely a battle of who can play that character better considering they're both going to be rocking that Jackie. So I'm looking forward to it. I'm yeah. looking forward to <laughs> this next match. And and there's definitely a lot of controversy that, that, that spins around Jackie Briggs, you know. Is the character broken? Is the character fair? She's got in touch. She's got she's got a couple uh, nerfs here and there. But, you know, with the addition to customs, I feel like that bitch got a whole nother layer added to her, bro. Yeah. She got some crazy shit she could do. She could have the leaps. She could have the, who, who the, the, the damage over the, the time. Who was it that we saw? It was hijinks. I Right. Hijinx was the one. He, he had a, a an extreme variation for Jackie Briggs. Mm -hmm. He had, like, mm -hmm. everything equipped, and it just looked really good. We also saw Tekken Master, you know, piecing together these ridiculous movesets at the Dragon Temple. And he ended up taking the fucking Dragon Temple $60,000, bro. Ooh, ooh. And you know who he did oh it with? Oh, my goodness. You know who he did it with? Jackie Briggs. Jimmy, oh, I thought it was Jim Bob Joe. Oh, you thought I was going to say Jimmy Neutron? Jimmy Neutron, no, yeah, the new guest no. character. Did Jackie you guys hear Briggs. about that? Did you guys hear about the Combat Pack 3 leak? Jimmy Neutron. It's going to be in the game. Uh, can can anybody... Is the brain blast. Oh, shit. <laughs> can anybody get in contact with Zork? Uh, Zork said in the chat he is joining. So just, Oh, okay, uh, sweet, hopefully. sweet. It should be good. It should be good. We'll give him just a couple moments here to get into the game, and then we'll load up. This is uh, Pool 4. You want to hit uh, exclamation point bracket if you want to keep up with the action yes and see what's going on uh and if you want to sign up for next week if you want to get ready for next week if you haven't signed up for week uh week four here if you want to get ready for week five hit exclamation point sign up in chat and you guys can get prepared for next week next wednesday 6 p.m eastern standard yeah. time over on twitch.tv slash destroyer fgc and foxy grandpa with the raid thank you very much Thank you very much, Foxy Grandpa. Much appreciated. Yo, can we make sure we get a shout out in chat for Foxy Grandpa? Thank you very much. Yo, much appreciated. Welcome, everybody. Welcome, everybody. I want to see those Shiva emotes. I want to see those Shiva emotes. Hit me with that. Hit me with the Shiva emotes. Come on. Yes. Come on. I want to see a wall. <laughs> Thank you I so see much. A wall. Thank you so much, Foxy. And and Caboose, did you report the scores for Get Wrecked and Nash Van? I, I did, oh, yes. Oh, okay. okay. Did, it not, did it work? Let me, I'll check again. Spanky Doodle was just making sure. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. We're good. All right, sweet. All right, we're getting into this. We got Tsunami versus Zork. I think this is going to be the Jackie Briggs mirror. Fucking uh, only stomps. Foxy Grandpa coming in here with a fat host. Thank you so much, man. Everybody showing love for the Champions of the Realms. And it's about to go down as we expected here, Caboose. We got... The Tetona's going at it. <laughs> the Jackie Mirror. <laughs> I love the variation name. Zork finally balanced. <laughs> Perfectly balanced. Yeah, right. All right, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, okay, you lying. Yeah. He's not balanced. Yeah. All right, yeah. I'm expecting I didn't a very... I the Thanos. Dude, I'm suspecting a very fast-paced match here. You know, two Jackie Briggs, like, oh my God, both of them going for the cancel in the air. But it looked like Zork, no, 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 I'm a little confused. I don't even know who's who. 
Okay, Tsunami's like gonna take it. <laughs> Tsunami's gonna take it. Tsunami, I think, is rocking the uh, like the, the god skin. Yeah, 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 the glowing eyes skin. Whereas uh, Zork is rocking the um, the Alan Ripley alien-looking skin with the pink. We gotta, we gotta have like, like it's UFC or something, like a tale of the taste. By the way, uh, those of you who are getting into the top eight, top eight is going down this Friday, 6 p.m. Eastern yep. time zone. So once you get into that top eight, you can relax. Nice throw there from Zork. He's having a great second round here. Oh, I got that cross up. Out on unfortunately. Had enough score. There's no fatal blow to worry about here. So Zork just gotta close this out. Nice. Spends the meter on the plasma ball, and that's gonna be the round. Beautiful stuff there. Damn, tied one one of one around here. It's a scary matchup we got going on. Good round though for Tsunami. Gonna get big damage off this combo. And that could have been it, but it's not going to be. Is any character that's capable of a lot of comeback oh, potential? Because it the opening Jackie breaks. Tsunami the just now corner. coming up oh. on two bars. Oh. Bro, what is going on? Oh! oh. He's oh not dead. God. He's not dead, oh Caboose. He's not dead, Caboose. Destroyer. He's still Destroyer. alive. He's still alive. Destroyer. He's still alive. It's gonna be just about even. It's gonna be just about even with a little bit of the life lead for Zork. Oh, he just walks right into it! Land. He just walks right into it, bro! Zork with a crazy fucking comeback in the ultimate Jackie Briggs mirror. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh my god! Holy what shit. a comeback from Zork! Just like I said, if any character is possible of making comebacks like that, it is Jacqueline Briggs and Zork after landing some ridiculous combos and some crazy setup. He goes for just a raw fatal blow, catches a button press or just no blocking, and then ends the round with the plasma ball. Beautiful stuff. What a first game. Yeah, man. The raw shoot and Pipo to take the comeback match. Unbelievable. Yeah. Zork exactly. right now really feeling himself here. And immediately both these characters going straight back to the mirror. Hey, shout out to Pulse in the chat. One of the finalists for the Champions of the Realm Season 2. We'll be seeing him this February for the finale. Yes, indeed. And Mighty Unjust. We got a bunch of finale uh, killers in here. Very good shit. Beautiful. He's going to get opened up. I think Zork is really feeling himself here, Caboose. I don't know. I so. <laughs> Toto. He's going to have to... <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting a little carried away, my bad, my bad. Just a little bit. Sorry, sorry. Give it up. Big combo from Zork, definitely riding the wave of momentum after that win in the first game. Oh! Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Is this gonna be the tsunami uh -oh. comeback right now? The vengeance! Oh my god. Yo, that's not, mad, not that's mad damage. I think he's not dead. Not breakable, by the way. Yo, I think he's dead. No, not breakable, oh by the way. Oh my god. Oh, it might be Magic Pixel. Oh, it's no. Magic Pixel. It's Magic Pixel. Whoa, oh, snapping wow, him over the air. The no scope 360 with the plasma ball. What do I need? I mean, tsunami. Bro. Up. A nice counter there from Tsunami. Lands the throw. Going to do a little bit of extra damage thanks to the Plasma Ball and the burn effect being applied. Oh my god, the Shoryuken! Drops a combo oh, though. That sounds too far for Tsunami. Trying to continue this and it looks like that should be the game. An incredible follow-up and answer after what happened in game one. We're all tied up in what is definitely looking to be a really crazy set. Yeah, this is looking crazy indeed. What the hell is going on here? 
Let's see if Zork is going to be able to bounce back. I mean, so far, what we've been witnessing is kind of back and forth. I'm not going to lie. It's kind of back and forth. Mm -hmm. I mean, sometimes we see Zork steamrolling. Sometimes we see Tsunami steamrolling. None of these players have had like a full on game where it was just all Jackie to themselves, you know? So let's see if it's going to stay like this. Very good matches we've been having today for week four, man. I cannot wait to see what the top eight's going to be looking like. Going down this Friday, right here, twitch.tv slash caboose. That's right. You guys better be there. 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time is going to be hype. Round one, fight. The jump back from Tsunami trying to play it safe, but still going to get tagged by Zork. Oh, my God, another opening. Zork is having a fiesta right now. Nice down to crush after neutral ducking that throw. Tsunami gonna get big damage off of this, 36%. Oh, the elbow drop from the top rope. That came out of nowhere. But wait a second, Zork slowly stealing this away. Oh my God, he sets up the chip damage. This is gonna be so tough for Tsunami. Fire is everywhere. Man, this is honestly, this is just about who can play this character better. There is, there is, you know, there's no unfair advantage. Yeah, everyone can have their opinions about Jackie here, but when it's Jackie versus Jackie, it's just all about the player skill. And clearly, both of these, both of these competitors are showing off an immense amount of skill. You are not lying about that. Nice throw. The stare down right now. He's going to try to open him up. Oh my God, the back and forth here. I'm loving the staggers from both these players, but it's kind of kind of going in Zork's favor. Wait a second, just as I say that, he gets combo to the left side of the screen. Watch out for that fatal blow, Destroyer. You really do. So weary of oh it. He's got to be so weary God. of it. Is he going to go for the fatal blow? Yep, yep. I don't think he's Unbreakable. Dead. Unbreakable, by the way. <laughs> unbreakable, by the way. Yo, is this unbreakable damage? This is unbreakable damage. Oh, it might be Magic Pixel scenario again. It is. Oh, God. Oh, and the Plasma Ball. Nicely Bro, it, done there from no Tsunami. Pain, no pain. With that Plasma Ball, after a situation like that, it is so fucking hard to make the comeback, bro. I'm liking the, the pressure, pressure here. Yep. He's trying to find an opening. Oh, the plasma nice. ball from the top of the dome. Didn't see it coming. He opens him up. Tsunami's in a really good position, catching the hey. crushing blow. Wait, what? Oh, what? Okay, never mind. The, the health bar glitched out for a second there. I was seeing Zork at fatal blow before he was uh, below 30%. That's, nice the, that's the famous, the famous Jackie Briggs melt your light bar before you can even see what's going on, Tech. <laughs> Straight up. <laughs> Oh, Fatal blow! This Fatal is huge! I don't, I, I don't know. I don't, is he dead? I don't think so. It's gonna be so close, Destroyer. It's gonna wait. Oh, it might be. Oh my it God! Is. It is. Zork closes it out. Oh my oh fucking my God. God, bro! Don't tell me this shit. Don't tell me this shit. This is so intense. What a friggin' set. That was really good, man. Zork taking it right underneath Tsunami's fucking feet. I cannot believe what we just witnessed here. Zork is going to be moving up two to one. One game away from getting into that top eight. Winner side, Caboose. Winner side. That's a big part of the plan if you want to get the ultimate win. If you want to get that big win and see yourself in that finale. Then staying in the winner side is one of the biggest parts to do it, man. I mean, we saw Pulse make a monumental reverse 3-0 last week, but yep. when do you see that shit? That's rare. I mean, just beyond that, you're when you're on the winner side, like of course, on, on the loser side, there's still plenty of opportunity. We saw someone like Asuna make a 
crazy run in the lower bracket. Pulse, just like you said, who was sent to the lower bracket, made a hell of a run and then got the, the bracket reset in Grand Finals. Got the but spins, just having yeah. that cushion, having the security in the winner side of the top eight always helps out. It gives you that second chance. It's always an advantage. All the pressure is real. Tsunami, he just cannot let Zork make a crazy comeback again. Because if that's the case, oh. we're going to be seeing Tsunami fall to that lo loser side, that lower bracket. Good punish there on the wake-up roll, which gets Tsunami the round. But I know, Destroyer, I, I, I got an inkling Sword. that we're going to a game five. You got a Shiba and Pipo? There's something bad going to happen? Shiba and Pipo, 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 Evolvo, 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 Evolvo. Oh nice my god, to and cash out. dude, you can kind of see like the dominance coming from Zork here. He's playing like very authoritative, you know? Just kind of yeah. walking up in his face, being very disrespectful. Hold on though, Tsunami answering back. Shoryuken! Wow, the pressure on both sides and the neutral jump punish. This will be good damage for Tsunami to get away with. 35% ends up being at 357 on the total. On the total? What? On the huh? What'd you say? <laughs> oh, wow! That string just barely connects and is able to whip punish. I think he's dead. And that'll be I a combo in the fatal blow. I think I, so. Yeah, this is like 50%. I think so. Oh, my God. He is gonna take the round again, Zork. Dude, how many times have we seen that fucking unblockable fatal blow combo already? <laughs> Unblockable, by the way. Oh, Zork had the right idea, just barely out of range, though. This is going to give Tsunami the opportunity to punish and get a nice 30% combo. The throw escape fail in the fire. 18% off that throw because of it, and there was still some continued damage over time. Oh, nice beautiful punish. opening, but no combo continuation from Tsunami. Instead, he gets a throw. The stare down in the corner. Oh. It had to be an input error. I'm not entirely sure if Zork maybe meant to do that. This is gonna be really tough. Zork gotta figure something out now or Whoa. never. Tried to get a punish in, but the plasma ball was tossed and we're going to a game five. Bro, come on, bro. Are you serious, bro? We're really going to a game five, bro. I don't know, some random dude just came into the fucking studio. Get the fuck out of here, man. What are you trying to host a tournament, man? Booze, is that your friend? Huh? Is that your cousin or something? No, what, what are you talking about? I'm about to dropkick this dude, bro. Hey, 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 hey. Jackie Briggs. Jackie Don't talk to him Briggs. like that. <laughs> my bad, my bad. Sorry. Well, how, how, who do you think you are? Sorry, huh? sorry. No, 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 no. Tell me. Who do you think you are? Tell me. <laughs> Leave him alone. Bro, final game here. How do you think this is gonna go? Final game. No, man. Uh, did, I don't know. It's been. Did we get channel points been... in this one? Yeah, 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 yeah. The the bets were put in. The bets were put in. It was uh, it was 85% towards Tsunami. So oh my god. If Zork wins this, anybody who voted or yeah, if anybody who voted for Zork could be winning some some crazy channel points. If Zork is able to win this, a nice throw there, escape fail, and attempted tech. I guess right in the positioning. Oh man, look at all the meters spent to stay in the air and inevitably get that punish. Good stuff there from Tsunami, but okay, Zork gonna find an opening. Spends the meter, still a nice 34% into a throw that's 13%. Great damage for Zora, throw. another throw connect. Just looking like he can close this out here, Caboose. Oh man, he had the opening, that could have wow. been a GG's, and he still wow. gets it. Max point for Zork. This is it, this is it. We're in game five. Winner goes to the top eight on that winner's side. The Jackie Briggs mirror has certainly lived up to the hype. Oh, an attempted neutral jump, but the air to air will get the roll out. Tsunami. Oh my goodness. Destroyer. Oh my goodness. Big combo coming in for Tsunami. I don't know. I don't know how to handle this, bro. This is too much. The speed. The... Oh, he's going to get the throw. This is big news for Tsunami. Wait a second. Oh. He gets the dash punch. A nice little juicy combo there coming out of Zork. 
Bro, I swear to God, this is so fucking back and forth. I really can't commentate this anymore. Tartan is oh, tossed he gets the the lead. We're going to a final game, Caboose. Final Holy. game. Final, final everything. everything. Oh Winner. my God. Winner is advancing to the top eight for this Friday, 6 p.m. Oh. Eastern time zone. Oh. Whoa. He's got the plasma on the ground. That's oh. crushed. That's crushed. This is going to be a huge advantage now for Tsunami. What do you do if you're worth 42%? Oh, he got the he got the roll! Wait! No! The combo gets screwed up. Oh my goodness. Destroyer. I can't look. Oh my god! A risky dash punch, but it pays off. Oh he tried to he tried to hit. He tried to anti air Oh he's all got a mag magic pistol. This is, no, not magic pistol, but he still has a chance here. Dun jump oh, in! Oh my god! He cannot fuck this up, Caboose! He cannot fuck this up! Oh my god! He's got oh the fatal blow on lockdown! Tsunami's gonna have a lot of life here, but this is it. The final read is gonna determine who Holy takes shit. this. Holy shit. One more read for both these players. The stare down. The fucking stare down. Holy shit. No! <laughs> Why would he risk it? Wow. Oh, he risked it so big. Wow. Dude, that was big balls from Zork right there to go for that dash punch. I mean, a lot of cojones, wow. and unfortunately, it doesn't pay off. And Tsunami will be moving on to the top eight on the winner's side. Still, though, you can't count out Zork, who will be now moving into the lower bracket. Has an opportunity to make top eight still. Oh, yeah, he's definitely still in this, man. With a Jackie Briggs that clean, I could definitely see him making it into the loser's side. And look, I want to mention something. Like, I don't mean to be rude or anything, but, you know, look, this bracket, it had a lot of a, a lot of silent killers, you know? Like, yeah. there weren't too many big names that you usually see like the previous weeks, but there was those players that could fucking, you know, could definitely upset any of the, of the top killers. And... Mm -hmm. This is, I feel like this is one of the weeks that players got to look out for to try to get that spot into the finale. Like, who knows what week five is going to be looking like? Who knows what week six yeah. is going to be looking like? So sign up now. Get your chance. Get as many opportunities as you can to get that uh, to get into that finale because we're closing in on a $2,000 finale prize pot. That's crazy. That's pretty fucking crazy. Yeah, that is pretty crazy indeed. It's uh, you're right. This is one of those weeks where, you know, there's uh, there's some wild cards. We could be going into another top eight where we see some silent killers. So let's see what happens. Oh, I believe Destroyer, we got one more match here for two our more. top. We got two more. two more, two more, two more matches for our top sixteen. Where are we going into pool two or pool three first? Uh, we're gonna do Abyss versus Hijinx, and then we're gonna save this mega insanity of a match, Kerbalicious versus Rewind, for the end for tonight. Yeah, but we are getting the invites out. We're going to have uh, Abyss going up against Hijinx. Dude, Jackie Briggs. He's coming in strong for this fucking yep. top 16 right now. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. So we got uh, we got Hijinx and Abyss up next. What do you know? This Let me see a pretty hype match. where Hijinx PSN is. Okay, I got it. I got it. Hijinx FGC. All right, invites have been sent. This should be a juicy one. Uh, Abyss, we know him for his noob Cybot. But, you know, as these players progress, as the time goes on, you know, we, we never know who they end up picking up. So we'll see. Maybe Abyss is going to come out with something new. We'll find out in just one moment. Yes, indeed. Getting them loaded up. Oh, we need a Tsunami, I believe, to leave the game. Oh, do we? Yeah, Ayo, hey, Tsunami, if you can leave the game so we can uh, make sure we get the next match loaded up, that would be appreciated. Please and thank oh, you. Me there. Hopefully he did hear. Tsunami may have went uh, AFK for a second there. Oh, this man fucking threw a goddamn party once he made it into that top eight. <laughs> especially, especially a match that close, you know? Like, I really feel like he just won that and he said, Let's go! Can somebody get in contact with Tsunami, please, and let him know that... That would be, yeah. ...that he's uh, still in this lobby. We'll have to reset the lobby if not. I hope not. Tsunami! 
Tsunami! I'm sorry. Oh man, thank god I went AFK so quick there. I would have had to fight hijinks. <laughs> I would have had to fight him. The and that would have been final too. We there no reverses. You're fighting hijinks. <laughs> And that's that would have became the top 16 match. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a business uh, match on the line there. If you lose, <laughs> he doesn't get in. If you win, he gets in. <laughs> Imagine some shit like that, bro. Oh, man, that would have been nuts. That would have been nuts. <laughs> Yo, Destroyer, though. On the, on the betting for the channel points, it's pretty close. 55% for Abyss, 45 for Hijinx. Oh, for this match so, that's going down right now? Yeah. Holy so the cow. Chat, the chat was pretty split on this one. This is gonna, either way this goes, some people are gonna be winning a decent amount of channel points off of it. Not bad, but not right. bad. I know you can fuck yourself you over go. with this channel points betting, so you, you do gotta, <laughs> you gotta play it smart, for sure. Why is, why is, uh, why is Gemini was in the chat earlier? He said he put all his channel points on Zork for that last match. <laughs> GG! <laughs> some of these, some of these addicts <laughs> in the chat. <laughs> GG! all right. Here we go, Abyss rocking noob Cybot hijinks of course, as you said, with that Jackie Drake. Very good stuff yeah. here, gonna catch him with a slam to the ground. Okay, yo, I love the pickups Abyss catches, man. And look at his variation name, Don't Zone. He tell, he's telling you right now, he said, listen, you zone, I'm gonna fuck you up. Yeah. Try right, to open him up, the down three into the low slide. Very good stuff we're witnessing from Abyss early on. And I, I'm not gonna lie, I think I had my fucking fair share of Jackie Briggs, so I'm gonna let you commentate this one alone, and I'll catch you tomorrow. <laughs> All right, I'll see you later, buddy. Uh... <laughs> kidding, I'm kidding. Nice to go. Abyss definitely staying in this. Managing against high is uh, Jacqueline Briggs right now. Watch out for that fatal blow though, Destroyer. Oh, a good throw. Had enough sports. This is scary. Oh, he tries to scary. catch him with the jump over. Wait a second, down to the wire. No anti-air from Abyss. Oh. And that's gonna oh, be Oh, the extra damage. I think that's the run. Yeah. Oh man. His face was, was just great. Yep, his face was piled on that plasma damage over time. Very unfortunate scenario for Abyss there. But yo, does this guy not have a uh, reliable anti-air for this character? Oh, I wonder if that down four is too much. Yo, Rewind in the chat says, who's trolling me? Rewind, we're trying to get to the bottom of that, man. We'll, we'll try and figure out what's going yeah, on. Yeah, with, Rewind. Uh... Rewind, we were defending you. We said, listen, if this guy isn't friends with you with a name like Rewind Stinks, he's a piece of shit. But it, it, if, if you guys are friends, then everything's cool. Yeah, but we, we definitely, definitely didn't approve of the name. That's for sure. Potentially could be the game, and the down two off the breakaway will do it. Hijinx taking game one. Yeah, very good stuff. Hijinx, you're right, taking round number one. And this will definitely be interesting if we see two Jackie Briggs getting into that top eight. Potentially three, because remember, fucking Zork still has a chance in that loser side can still get into that top eight. So could you imagine if we get three Jackie Briggs for week four? That's definitely gonna send a message to Netherrealm. Oh, they better man. nerf the fucking character. And not only oh, that, man. but that's gonna show that people are really trying to get in that money, you know? They are playing to win. Taking no prisoners. So dungeon. All right. Game two about to be underway. Caboose, how do we sign up for uh, Champs of the Realm? What are the requirements? Oh, I'm glad you asked. Uh, first of all, you just hit an exclamation point sign up in the chat. And then second of all, all you got to do is make sure you got an Ethernet cable plugged in. Because if you're on Wi-Fi, you're getting forward four drop kick by Aaron Black. And then second of all, make sure you're in North America. And then third, just play, make sure you're playing on PS4. Even if you got a PS5, you can switch to the PS4 version of the game and compete. And uh, get it done. Get ready. Sign up. Week 5 will be taking place next week, Wednesday, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Twitch.tv slash DestroyerFGC. Yes, yeah, sign up, guys. You won't want to miss out in the action. And hold on a bit right now. Going with uh, the Fujin pick. With the um, Mads Mickelson. No, no, no. <laughs> 
<laughs> what do you mean no no no? This is fucking Mads Mickelson. Bro, I'll pull up side by side images of Mad Mickelson and Fujin right now. And you'll see the you'll see the comparison. I'll get the Mad Mickelson from Death Stranding with the white hair. It is a oh shit, it's Fujin. Well, he goes with the down one. Whoa! Wait! Wait! Wait, what? Hold on! That was some pretty ridiculous stuff there from Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Is this game working? Oh, the interactable. Yo! Caboose! I saw armor! I hijinks got hit! I don't understand what just happened. I don't know. Hijinks had armor. Crushing glow. Dude. I don't understand. I can't commentate this match anymore. And on my screen, Hijinx had armor. Did you not see that? I, I must have missed it. I'll, I'll have to check if somebody clips it. But after all that, the first game goes to Hijinx. Or sorry, the second game goes to Hijinx. Hijinx now up 2-0. Oh, okay, he went behind Fujin and hit Fujin's armor. No, 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 no. Somebody get a clip. Somebody get a... Yo, yo, yo. Get the silver ride. Get the clip. He, he got the, silver he got ride. The get the clip. He got the Fujin armor. He Somebody the, get he the, the clip. Please. He hit the armor, he hit the Fujin, and he was with, with the Fujin. Hijinx even said it, Destroyer. Come on, get it together. Get, get it together, clip. Destroyer. Get the clip. Get it together. Listen, get Destroyer. the clip. Destroyer. Hijinx himself is get saying, the clip. that's it. All right, security. Get the clip. Get him out. Get him out. Get him out. I want to see Spanky the, Doodle. I, wanna, I don't I'll, care. I'll comment there with Spanky Doodle. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. You want to put Spanky Doodle on the, on the mic? Get the I'll clip. comment there with him. I don't care. Clip it. Uh, you're getting banned. Oh shit! Yo, come you're on, done. chill, chill, chill. No, you're done. Yo, yo, don't That's ban it. me, don't ban me. You're, you're finished. You're, it's over. Yo, 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 don't ban me, bro. Oh, oh, no, it, it's too late. It's he too banned late. me. It's too late. It's all good, guys. Destroyer is officially banned. He cannot. Uh, Take he'll never be able to, to talk in the chat. So you're, we're good. Don't worry, guys. I'm gonna block him too. It's not letting me type anything in the chat. What? Bro. Bro, why? Come on, man. I'm trying to curse you out in the chat. Oh, my God. <laughs> Hijinx right now up 2-0 against Abyss. And Abyss is going to go right back to that. <laughs> Just saw you in the chat. Abyss is going to go right back to the noob Cybot pick. I have high hopes. I honestly feel like we got to see more anti-airs coming out of Abyss. And listen, <laughs> you're probably looking at me saying that like, Destroyer, are you fucking serious? You try anti-airing this fucking character. I know, it's not easy. It's not easy. Wow. But he's got to try. That was a pretty try. risky uh, teleport, but it works out that's there. It. Okay, okay. Right there. there you go. And that's what I've been waiting for, the up shadow. I wasn't too sure if he had it in his arsenal, but now that he, he used it... It's confirmation that he's got to start using that shit for the anti-airs. You know, regardless of what positioning uh, Hijinx goes for, for the uh, the little plasma ball cancel in the air, I feel like that anti-air is going to connect. You know? You know what I mean? Yeah. No, exactly. All right. Tries to catch him with the crossover, but nothing's there. The stare down right now from Abyss. That is it, bro. Why has he been waiting for... What the fuck? Why okay. is he doing it now? Why okay. is he doing it now? He heard you. He's watching the stream. He's definitely nice. watching the stream. Back one into the amplified slide. All you got to do is just be weary of getting caught into one of those ridiculous, unblockable, unbreakable fatal blow combos. Not unblockable. But unbreakable fatal blow combos. Oh my goodness, and another throw is gonna connect for hijinks. Oh, he's gonna clip oh, him, and that's man. gonna be a done deal. Hijinks right now sitting on match point, looking to send Abyss to the lower bracket with a clean 3 0. Nice, anti air again. It looks like that has become the difference maker here for Abyss in order to sort of shut down. This Jackie Briggs try to get it again. Oh my goodness. Oh, but Hijinx no. just narrowly avoiding. Okay, nice crushing blow off the back one. One plus three. Let me try to go for it again. A little too late though. 
Good opening. The stagger on the mid. This is huge. Hijinks looking to close this out here. Oh, boy. Oh, oh that could have been it. I think this is Chip. Whoa! Oh, wait! No, he didn't close it. Oh, my God. And the fatal blow will do it. The wrong... Hijinx going to take that set 3-0. Unfortunate for Abyss, but Abyss not out of it. Heading into the lower side of the bracket. But Hijinx is going to the top eight on the winner's side. Right now, who's joining him on that winner's side? We got... Let me check real quick. Fatality. We got Get Wrecked, Tsunami, and Hijinx wins. so far in the winner's side of the top eight. And there's one more match to go. Listen, Destroyer. I don't want to say we saved the best for last, but this next match is pretty fucking hype. We got this player, Rewind fucking Stinks, running around fucking beating a lot of ass in this tournament. And mm. he's going to be going up against Kerbalicious for the final match in the winner's side of the top 16 for tonight. I mean... I want to see some hype in the chat. Caboose. I want to see some fucking hype in the chat right now. If I don't see nothing but hype in the chat for the next 10 seconds, then I promise you, I promise you, we'll wrap up the stream. I don't want to have another tsunami moment either. Hijinks, please we'll get out of the, the fucking lobby. <laughs> yeah, hijinks. Uh, we need you to leave the lobby. Yo. Oh, well, hold on. Let me unmute. Yo, hijinks. We need you to leave the lobby. So we can get the next players invited to run the last match. Thank you very much. There we go. Perfect. Right, Thank you so much, left. brother. And congratulations on making that top eight spot, dude. Congratulations. We're going to the final game for top 16, everybody. And Caboose, I'm not looking at the chat, but is the chat lit? Because if it's not there's, lit. There's hype. Don't worry. We don't got to end the stream. If we're it's not lit, the hype. match is not starting for another two hours. That's the rules. Uh, maybe we should just hold them for two hours then. What do you think? <laughs> We'll do that for the finale. We'll do that for the finale. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. All right, Rewind's in the chat, by the way. Rewind is in the chat actively right now. Oh, shit. Hold on, I want to go over to Rewind's stream. I want to make sure that... Yeah, okay, go, okay. go to his house. Go to he's his house. He's a... <laughs> go to his house right now and see if he's fucking playing in the hiding. Uh, yo, Rewind, you better not be... Uh, you better not, that better not be you. That better not be you, you know? But all right, Kerbalicious gonna be facing off against uh, against Rewind's things. <laughs> this is our last match of our top 16 matches. The last match for tonight for the pool play of Champions of the Realms 2 week four. Should be a good one. Whoever wins this, yeah, whoever wins this rounds out the winner's side of our top eight. And oh man, I, I am excited for this. What we saw, li listen, I, I don't know who this Rewind's things is, okay? Some people have said it might be Sonic. A lot of people were almost convinced it was Sonic. Yeah. Um, and and listen. And, and if it is them. I don't want to be that guy to say it is, but like th th these claims aren't too far-fetched because the skill level is there. You know, Rewind Stinks yeah. knows. Oh, oh, yo, fucking Kerbo with the trolling, bro. I thought he was about to hit this <laughs> man with the mirror match. But nope, we're seeing the true pride in, pride out. Cabal coming out of Kerbalicious. This is the Rewind main character. Rewind saying it's Sonic. Oh, shit. I can't tell if Rewind's trolling though. Yo. I need like I need evidence. I need the concrete answer. This is too much, man. We're, we're never gonna know. We're never gonna you know what? I'm ending the stream. Oh, okay, Rewind said I don't know who it is for. <laughs> All right, here we go. See, yo, that's one thing we've seen a lot of from uh, the hard from Rewind. Reads. Hard the little, read. The little read. Oh man, speaking of an armor breaker to start off this game with the water bubble. And a big corner combo. Good stuff there from Rewind Six. I don't yeah. know, man. I feel I feel bad saying this name, especially with Rewind in the chat. Rewind, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> Hold on, My look bad. at this. Reginald Kerbalicious <laughs> answering back and a catch him with a knockdown. The one, one, one wake up pressure. Toma, maldita mierda. Yo, mad pressure from Kerbalicious right now. Not letting up with chip damage alone. This dude's almost dead. You gotta watch out for though, Destroyer. Oh, that's big. And that should be. Oh, dropped combo. Wait. Oh my goodness. A second chance for Rewind Stinks now. A pop of the air projectile. Oh my god. And, and that'll forward, be the forward, round. Forward pork closing it out. Final game for the top 16 winner side tonight. This is if it's insanity. 
Rewind says it might be unjust. If it's unjust, then that's that's a ban. Because unjust, mighty unjust qualified already. Yeah, he already qualified. <laughs> why would he? Why? We gotta find out, man. That would that would be a yeah. That would be an instant ban. Good throw. He's got him in the corner. Another one-one beautiful conversion coming out of Kerbalicious. Really fighting against this uh, rewind stings here. Hold on, is is he gonna be able to make the comeback? It's gonna be tough. It really is. Kerbalicious is putting some crazy fucking pressure here. The jump in three, the down one. Oh my God! Wait a nice. second. He drops oh, it. What? What happened? Oh no! He drops it. That's it. That's the game. He drops it, and just like that, Kerbalicious taking game number one against Rewind stinks. Yeah, who does play Rain? Okay, yeah, we got Ati, we got K7. People were people were suggesting that it could have been uh, who was suggesting it could have been um, uh, Ninja Killer, but I think that's been kind of debunked. K7 is not. That's been debunked. People, uh, it is okay. All right. You know what? I know I was joking the first time, but yeah, it's it's me, guys. It's me. Sorry, everyone. Sorry, man. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to offend you with the name. I was just, you know, I was all looking right, to make a little right. bit of noise. All right, we're we're banning you immediately. <laughs> Let's see what happens here. I mean, Kerbalicious taking game number one against Rewind Stinks. See if he's going to be able to turn things around. This rain has been making some outrageous plays. And one thing I got to admit is the reads on that little anti-air he makes with the water sprout. I feel as he does, if he does it just a second later, Caboose, just a second later, it's going to work out for him almost every time. Yeah. Yeah. Because he, he always does it a little too early and, and catches the whiff. I mean, he's not really getting punished too hard for that whiff. So, oh my God, that's going to be a big whiff punish though. And the counter right back to back. Kerbalicious is really having his way here. Beautiful little combo there from Kerbalicious. He continues up with this momentum. We could see Rewind Stinks being sent to the lower bracket. I mean, we've seen we've seen some ridiculous tech from this competitor here. <laughs> Oh, this is going to be one of the greatest mysteries in the history of Champions of the Realm. BuzzFeed's about to make an Unsolved Mysteries episode on just on just this guy. <laughs> <laughs> Who is Rewind Sting? <laughs> oh my nice. god. Do you see how how well timed that was? The the micro dash up into the 111 from Kerbalicious. He just knew exactly what Rewind Sting had in mind. Yep. That was a solid block attempt there from Kerbalicious on that jump in using the, uh, I don't know what you call it, the, the rising water thing. Too slow. Too slow. Balling. Nice anti here. Okay. And the armor breaker. Armor breaker. Very good stuff. Rewind thing still in this 100%. He's going to go for the overhead. I don't think in the history or, or, or throughout all four weeks so far of Champions of the Realm have we seen more armor breakers than we have through all of uh, Rewind Stinks now. <laughs> Seriously, and what a dominant performance there, taking that round with with ease. Let's see if he can keep that up. Whoa, there you go! Timing it just a little better that time, catching it. That was sick. Jump. Delicious. Ready for oh, it. And the air. God. Another armor breaker. <laughs> oh my god. He's like 10 for 10 with the armor breaks, bro. Nice throw there from Turbo. Has the corner. Good grab. We got an entire search party in the chat trying to figure out who this person is. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Send them out. Send them out. Find this man. The neighborhood watch. The neighborhood watch is this full fest. <laughs> nice back Find who this guy is. Make a back dash. Oh, was looking for that anti-air. Amplifies the Qatar. 
I love the riff. I, and I really like how Rewind Sneaks is he's mixing up the options, you know? He's not being predictable at all. Look at this combo. Purblicious with no meter to break away kind of had to hold all of that. This is going down to the wire here. Oh. Oh my god, he's got to hold this pressure! He couldn't flawless this block! Down one! Wow! And that'll be it! Guaranteed! Thanks to committing to the overhead and getting rid of the defensive meter on ship, we're tied up in this set, Destroyer. People still think it's Ninja, but but in the last time that we saw this Rewind Sings playing, Ninja was kind of active in chat while they were playing. So, unless Ninja is, is the young god, of multitasking, I don't think it's Ninja Killer. Dude, like, you, I, I feel like I'm pretty good at calling out these type of situations, but this one, it got, it has me torn. I don't fucking know. I haven't the slightest clue. It, it's because the thing, the thing that's killing me I'm is every, pumped, every everybody I'm suspecting is fucking popping up in the chat, and I'm just like, what? <laughs> Like it's not him. It Mr. Aquaman. <laughs> uh, oh, it could be. Aquaman does have a fucking rain. Yeah. But why why rewind stinks? Aquaman would yeah, not. I know. He that's, would not. That's the curveball. That's the ultimate curveball, right? If it was any other Heidi, I feel like maybe we could kind of get to the bottom of this a little easier. But it's the name that is the X factor in figuring out who this person is. It, like when you hear rewind stinks, you'd hope it's somebody that's close to rewind that can like joke around on that level, you know? Yeah, someone said Scar. I've heard Scar before. Scar, does Scar have a rain? I don't know. I mean, I remember I remember before we had to delay week two, Scar was entered uh, in, in the tournament at one point. You're right about Maybe? that. You're right about that. He did have thoughts about getting up in this action. Yeah. The forward two. This is getting out of hand here. Herbalicious is going to open him up with the corner switch combo. A lot of damage on the table. The knockdown in full effect. And the forward four gonna close it out. Kerbalicious. Round two. Fight. Oh, he's trying to go for the stagger. Did Tyler lands down? <laughs> oh my god. Tyler! Yo, ima imagine he turns on the mic and he starts talking about football. <laughs> he turns on the mic. He says the Niners just lost 3-4. Fuck you all. And he turns it back off. I say, holy shit, Tyler, what? He, he runs an emergency combat cast. He catches it with the reef stand. The pressure is on full effect here. Rewind stinks. Really trying to turn shit around. <laughs> I fucking can't. <laughs> oh, oh, no! Beautiful no! pickup there from Rewind stinks. <laughs> this is the fatal blow. That should be the round. This man does not die. He definitely is playing. Oh, get take that fucking wave, splashing it in his face. What a character. Fart. <laughs> this is insane. People are just dying to figure this one out, bro. I'm dying to figure this one out. It's killing me. Oh, man. He, he tried to catch the wake up from Kerbalicious, but was just a little too slow. But the ambition was there. See what he does. Oh, my God. The wrong Nomad Dash out of nowhere from Kerbalicious. Taking a huge chunk of life there. The side switch throw. Very good stuff. Rewind stinks right now with the life deficit, but he's still very much in this set. Yo, I don't know, dude. That movement was crispy as fuck. Oh, oh that's a big crush. That could be the game. That could be the game, and I think it might be, so long as Turbo manages to fully convert, and indeed he will, going up 2-1 now. Oh wait, pure? Pure? People are saying 100% pure. Oh, pure how? Pure started how? using rain recently. There was some. There was a comment. Okay, who was it from? Someone said something about pure being in, in a Discord. And oh, rewind is saying that pure is deafened in Discord right now. 
and that may be the proof that it is indeed pure. Oh my god, man, the fucking... We got Inspector Gadget in the case trying to figure this shit out. Unbelievable. Hold on, hold on, rewind. Do you know Pure well enough for him to do something like this? Make make a Heidi called Rewind Sucks? Is that uh is that the truth? I don't know. I don't know. Call the police. People are still thinking it might be even just rewind. I don't know what the hell is going on. I don't know what the hell is going on. All right, you know what? This is going too far. Let's just DQ him. I don't know him. what the hell is going on. This is going too far. Let's just DQ him. Everyone's saying pure type in the chat mid-match. All right, let's see what happens. Kerbalicious is up 2-1 on the verge to making it into the top eight. My question is, if Rewind Stinks loses, is he going to play his matches in the loser side? Oh, what? How did? How does that fucking connect? Cabal. This character's Cabal reach it. is yeah. He, he's Cabalin for sure. Yeah, Pure is in the chat, by the way. And he's not up. saying nothing. I give up. I think. I think maybe the chat figured it out. Gonna catch him with the command, the, the grab. <laughs> Got him stuck in the corner here. Kerbalicious fighting his way out. Gonna catch a grab of his own. Yo, how many times is he gonna go for that read? Ooh, that is throw. like a predefined tool set of his. Oh. To just, no fucking way. Oh god. No way. Oh god. No way. I don't think this is it though. I don't think that's closing out the round. No way. It's gonna be close. No, yeah, he's really alive. close. He's gotta watch out for a fatal blow from from Kerbalicious. Oh, that was. Such a risky interact. Well, I'm Why? not entirely sure what Rewind Thinks was thinking there. Round two. I think he just fucking threw it away. Oh, the bags. Mid-match, the bags. Yeah, you know, Kerbalich just definitely knows he just stole that away from Rewind Stinks. So he's going to give him the bags to kind of intimidate him here, you know? Yeah. Kind of throw him off his feet. That is definitely a wasted fatal blow. Which puts Rewind Stings in a very tough position. Match point for Kerbalicious. Nice. Goes for the full screen. Gonna backdash. Trying to regain positioning here. Oh my god. Trying to go for the standing one anti air, but nothing was there. Wait a second. This is huge for Kerbalicious. Oh my god. Oh. I think this is looking like a done deal, bro. This is, this is gonna hurt. Oh, he's dead. And that he's dead. is it. Rewind Stinks has been sent to the loser side of the bracket. And the bags. Oh, the bags. Another fatality, I believe. Or is it a friendship? No fatality coming out. Kerbalicious will be the last contestant or competitor making it to the winner's side. Very good. Of oh, the top eight for Champions of the Realms 2, week 4. What a week, Caboose. What a week. We had, like... I don't know. I, I definitely, I think uh, one of the big highlights for this week is who the fuck is Rewind Stinks? I mean, he didn't take the dub. He didn't get into the top eight, but who knows? Maybe we'll be seeing him make an appearance in the loser side. And I want to yep. say right now, if you guys want to be followed up with all that stuff, a lot of people ask me, yo, Destroyer, where do I sign up? Well, if you're not watching the live stream, uh, you can always check out our social medias, especially our Twitter pages. We always keep everyone up to date on Twitter. And, you mm -hmm. know, nowadays, Twitter is like the main staple social media for FGC. I don't know why it became that way, but that's just how it is. So yep. if you are invested in the FGC, make yourself a Twitter, man. Follow myself or Caboose. Get yourself involved with all the information. You're going to find yourself encountering many fucking tournament opportunities that you're not going to mm -hmm. want to be uh, missing out on. And it's great for everybody. So, yeah, we're going to be giving you the full top eight breakdown on twitter it's going to be going down this friday 6 p.m eastern time zone on caboose's twitch channel uh we can take That's a right. quick look to see who got into the top eight winner side so far no. let's do it you want to fuck you want to do it yeah, whoa, whoa. 
Huh? Let's fucking do it. No, not, 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 yeah. not do that. Oh, right, right, right. Oh, we actually already got someone on the lower side of the bracket who's made it into top eight. The Biohazard. Story. Biohazard made yeah. it. Yeah. So we're yeah. going to have Get Wreck versus Tsunami. We're going to have Hijinks versus Kerbalicious. And in the lower bracket so far, we got Biohazard. And as I said again, make sure you're following us on the Twitters. Uh, Twitter.com slash Caboose. Twitter.com slash DestroyFGC. We'll be posting the top eights, uh, the full top eight bracket on there. And yeah, we hope uh, to see you all then. You got any final thoughts, yeah. Caboose? This week was crazy. Literally, just as we were talking, by the way, So Sick Nash fan made it into the lower side of the bracket as well. We'll be facing off against Biohazard in Losers Round nice. 1. Nice. Nice. Um, so yeah, this, this top eight is really shaping up. And I mean, what else can I say besides another round of really hype matches for week four of Champions of the Realms 2? We really appreciate every single one of you who tuned in to all the people who gifted subs today, to all the people who subbed, resubbed, all that fun stuff. Thank you so much. You guys much. are amazing. Thank you, thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart for all the support today. It's absolutely ridiculous. We'll be back this Friday, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for Top 8. You guys better be there because you know it's going to be hype. And with that said, guys, thank you. Sign up as well. Sign up. If you if you didn't participate in week four, get ready for week five. If you were eliminated in week four, get ready for week yes. five next week. And what are the requirements? Wednesday. Ethernet cable. Plug that shit in. North America. Live in that place. PlayStation 4. Play on that console. Or PS5 and make sure you're playing the PlayStation 4 version. All you got to do is just that. And you can participate in Champions of the Realms. And just hit exclamation point. Sign up in chat.